mute over here on the other side there. Oh, you didn't hear that. <laughs> no, it sounds great on my end. How's the sound, everybody? Hi, Tara. Hello, hello. Oh, wait. So I am so glad that <laughs> the good old go out, come back in thing worked. Um, I shouldn't even say it, but we were having a little bit of technical difficulties beforehand. Don couldn't hear me. And if anybody ever watched my live that I did over on my channel with my daughter, Jordan, where she couldn't hear me, it was disastrous. <laughs> but we're here and we can hear and it's, I think I jinxed something though. I'm, I'm just, I think I did because we have been having the most beautiful spring weather all week been amazing we schedule a spring fling sale and i got the heater turned back on today oh great it is cold and windy and rainy and blah. <laughs> yeah 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 it was uh it was really bad here yesterday too i uh i had to turn around i was one of those people on the road uh that decided that i didn't want to risk it and there were people that were risking it and i was not one of them I also felt like once I got across after two hours, how was I going to get back? Mm. You know? Yeah. So, yeah. So everyone. And I just here, watched your video and it's like, you were talking about how glorious the weather was too. Oh, it was so glorious. You did it too. You did that it too. Was, I'm not taking the whole blame. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I messed up the, uh, the mic. Is that what they're talking about? No. What, Me. What? I did. Uh, we were talking about that lie live that i did that was so bad oh yeah. oh okay because i just had an echo like five seconds ago that i hi oh. margo hi. and i got my i've got my little volume thing down so hopefully we don't have an echo oh it was guys... totally my fault i had two windows open because i was you know gotcha yeah yeah, you guys tell us if there's any if there's any audio or visual issues, we will make sure it's not on our end. <laughs> Nancy <laughs> says, remember, Noah fixed the problem. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So just make sure you guys are in live chat and not top chat because you will miss things if you're in top chat. And uh, this is not your normal live sale that you see, you know, in other places. We do things a little different here. And uh, one thing you need to know is you don't have to wait for us to show the items that are included in today's sale. In fact, there could already be some things sold. I haven't checked my little collection over in the Niche Lady shop. Um, but we are going to show you the main link to go and shop in our shops. And you can shop away. You don't have to wait. And uh, what we are going to do is show items that you guys want to see. We're going to talk more about them, show you the details, maybe do measurements if you want them and that yeah. kind of thing. And of course, um, you're always able to scan the little QR code or hit the link, go over and find those items. Now, I have a lot of stuff in my spring fling category, and I don't think I'll get to all of it today. You never know. Uh, Guess but, what? I'm light. I don't no. have a lot of stuff, so it's going to work out great. And I so feel I'll make, like I'll make so up happy for it. to be with you. I love being with you and hanging out with you. I feel like I haven't seen you in so long, and this really feels no. nice. I know. It's been, I. you know, I, I'm sorry. I got to. Let me I try something. I got to turn this one off because it's like right in my, there we go. Oh, there this you is go. too much in my face. The migraine. Yeah. I couldn't do it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's, uh, it's taken me a couple of weeks to get back into a groove and I will be here much more regularly. I'm going to be doing some solo shows. Yep. We will not be here next Sunday because of course it is Easter Sunday. So we will be taking a break from next Sunday. I don't know. Do you have something planned for Friday? Or are we yeah. gonna do something together on Friday? It's up to you. Whatever you want to do. Oh, we could do we could do our rhinestones and pearls. Let's do it. It's kind of a continuation of the spring fling. I love it. Yes. Yes. Yeah, and we'll I've that. been pulling for that and putting things aside. So, you know, yeah. Uh oh, Nancy says you have mostly sold outs. <laughs> 
Oh no, my gosh. <laughs> I've been spending the last three hours putting stuff in. That's not a bad thing though. No, it's great. It's really great. And you know what? I get to be here with you. So yeah, we're going to have so fun. Happy. Yeah. I really feel fun. Like I'm into the fun. Yeah. I really like, I just, this is how Danny and I, you know, we, we're good friends, but we don't get yeah. to socialize. Right. Like we live near each other or we're both not workaholics, you know, so this is a way <laughs> that two type A personalities can hang out together and still like it counts as being productive. Right. Yeah. And then we let you guys in here too, to like, we just, just, yes, to hang out with our us. shenanigans. I can't. <laughs> wow, Nancy. Wow. Wow. Okay. All right. So the double D's, <laughs> the double D's. I love that. Oh my goodness. But yeah. So anyway, guys, you can go over and shop. Um, we're getting asked for the links again. So those links do show up over in the chat. Now we are streaming also over on my Facebook page and those links should show up in there as well. Let me know if they don't. Um, I can see the comments both from Facebook and from YouTube here. Hi, mom. <laughs> Hi, Danny's <And> mom. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She's been going a little, little outside the jewelry. Did you know you're going to have to go watch her videos to see that? But yeah. I listed some very nice things. Um, not jewelry uh, before, before we started. And I didn't get to everything I wanted to. Uh, I thought I forgot. I'm so used to starting. I'm such a creature of habit. I'm so I used know. to starting at seven. Yeah. Sundays is just a little different because yeah. it's both of us. Yeah. Yeah. And it's a day, I think, where people end the day sooner on Sundays, you know, kind of getting prepared for yeah. the week to come. So, yeah, agree. All right. Well, hey, how about we get how about we get started? I just had a question come through for an item so I can start with that. Oh, fantastic. Item. If I can go find it let me go find it okay all right so this is how this works guys we put an item up on the screen <laughs> i have a lot of items oh the here. tulip vase Ta -da! Oh, now this is not a signed piece so um it's hard to say if it's a mccoy or a shawnee or a but it is one of those mid-century companies. I have seen it attributed to Gonder, but I couldn't like verify, verify that. And what I mean by verify is find a piece with its original label or um, like an absolute expert, you know, like an, a high-end auction house that attributes it. I couldn't get that verification, but it is of that style. I mean, it does have the Gonder style. Uh, this was used by someone, so there is a line kind of where the dirt fill was in here, if you will. It's got the little pin marks on the bottom, and let me get you a measurement on it. It's a console vase. It is eight and a half inches tall. Oops, it'd be nice if you could actually see. Do you know, that. like consoles or demi loon tables, entry tables? See how it's like, like not like it's it's it's. See that. Like, so it's meant to go like on a thin table. All right. A ball or a mirror. Yeah. And it's, you know, I still am working on my color. I do have, I have a friend that's going to come over this week and help me with all this lighting stuff. It looks so good. It's, it's just, it's washing it out though. It's much peachier pink mm. than it's the, the picture is truer to the color than what I'm like seeing my camera showing, but there you go. So the way you purchase an item is you can either scan the QR code, which takes you directly to it, or there should be a link showing up in the chat that also takes you to it the old fashioned way. But yeah. we did that because if you're like, if you're on a TV, you should be able to scan that code from like, have your phone and scan it from the TV. Oh yeah. Thing. Just mm -hmm. act like you're taking a picture and you'll see like a little yellow bracket, you hit it and you're right there. Indeed, indeed. So that was my first item. Um, let me show another vase that I've had a lot of questions about. Oh my goodness. Finding it in here. Let's see. Oh. 
Happy spring, One Way Vintage. Oh, I don't see it. Did it not get... Sometimes our software can be very, very frustrating. Let me see if I can find it. Like really Susan easy. says she likes seeing both of us together. Aw, we like being together Susan, because it is yeah. fun to do this together. Watch out, world. <laughs> oh, and I did so. Okay, this is a little like behind the scenes. So our software uh, likes to add the last picture as the the picture that it shows. So I went to great, great efforts to add the first picture as the last picture on all my listings. Guess what? It's not working. It picked the third. Wow. That's insanity. <laughs> I, you can't win. You, you can't win. win. Okay. Yeah. I think I got this. So I'm fixing the picture on this one that I'm going to show you. <coughs> Oh. This, and a lot of people said that's not Raku. This is what Tony Evans Raku looks like. It, it, oh. it is a Tony Evans piece from the 90s. And it is not your traditional black bottomed Raku. It is signed Evans 148. His it's pieces numbered. are all very, very unique um, because of the way they're fired. And that's how all of this happens. It's um, so gorgeous. I was so stoked when I found this because, you know, I'm not a big fan of the 90s style. I think it's because I lived it <laughs> in a time that was not great for me. And, yeah. and so, you know, it was always kind of, mm, but now that, but it is, it's so popular now. It's the pastels and the. Well, that's a really beautiful example. I mean, that is true art. Yeah. I, I, I think I saw you pick that up and say, maybe not. It's so big. Or maybe you didn't know, or, or maybe you knew right away. I forget what it was, but I remember seeing you pick it up and going, please take it. Please I, take I picked it. it up with kind of like that. Oh, let's look at it. And then when I saw that, I was like, oh yeah, yeah, we're going to take that. <laughs> yeah. It's exquisite. It's yeah. subtle. It's sublime. It's not just 90s. It's gorgeous. No, it is. That transcends. It's current. Yeah. Yeah. So I figured this is a good segue into that piece that was in your video today. I'm going to, hopefully it's not sold out. Shall I try and find it? Did oh, it? yes. Okay. Here it is. Charles Folked. I know you have to be really careful with that name on YouTube. Yeah. Folked. <laughs> I, okay, so I was drawn to this immediately because it is a thing of beauty. Yeah. Right. Like, and I know beauty and I know, like when I met Rob, I knew the kind of art that he had in his house. He has the best taste out of anyone that I've ever met in my life. Right. And so I picked it up knowing that it was something great. And then I saw this and that's where the Danny lessons started to kick in. Because really, this is not my niche right. at all, right? It's something that I recognize as beautiful and artful, but really not my niche, And right? So I saw this and, you know, my immediate thought, what would Danny do? Now, what if you found out about it? Because I'm interested. I, I have picked up the, the it's Charles Falked, and I have picked up his stuff before, but it's never had like you know, done in Bradstreet on it. So I'm, I'm a little fascinated so by that. The, the fascinating thing about this is this uh, done in Brand, Bradstreet was located, located near where I am now. It was in Short Hills, New Jersey, the corporate headquarters. This was commissioned by them for him. I, no, by, by, by them from him. He did it for them, right? He also, I found something online that was less beautiful that was commissioned by Hewlett Packard, which I think was California, right? And so, mm -hmm. and it was dated a year later and that was uh, selling for $50. So that's why I made it $50. I think this one is better. I also found other pieces by him. He was a commissioned artist, mm -hmm. you know, this went into the corporate headquarters. This was in the- I was gonna say, so would it have been uh, like a, present or would it have been like a piece put in the lobby it was like in the lobby or the conference okay. room or or one of those yeah interesting um 
so anyway, so I, you know, it's exquisite, right? I made yeah. it a, I made it a price where I thought someone would want to snag it because you did. Yeah. Right. And probably Rob is looking at it going, Oh, that works so well with my collection or whatever, but you can't eat pottery <laughs> and drive pottery. Right. <laughs> It's, so, it's fabulous. It's yeah. fabulous. Yeah. Loved it. Uh, I feel like I'm going to move to the yellow. I'm going to move. Now, some of these items are also in my on sale category. I just, oh. I pulled some things that are spring. I mean, that's what, spring. Spring. spring I have spring a couple spring. pieces of the yellow fiesta. So I'm into butter dishes lately. I've always been into butter dishes. Yeah. Well, you may have noticed in my videos, I'm like, I'm picking up butter dishes like left and right. Um, this is Fiesta, even though it's not marked. It does not that's say because, Fiesta, but it is because, totally Fiesta. That's because I'm your, your demographic. I'm your perfect demographic. I've always been into butter dishes. <laughs> oh, okay. But it's a yummy spring yellow. You know, the Fiesta yellow. It's a buttery yellow. Yeah. <laughs> It's a butter yellow. So I have that. And how cute would that look in a kitchen with like vintage dish towels? Oh, let me see if I can find this now. I did not put anything in any particular order. Here we go. Um, I'm sorry. This is not Fiesta. This is Franciscan. My bad. Um, but look how they're the same era and the Perfect. same yellow and they go together. Literally like, yeah, let me show you together. Look. Oh, it's wonderful. No, it's wonder. I mean, that's, you know, that's a wonderful kitchen, right? It's a happy kitchen. It's cheerful. You get up in the morning and you're in a good mental place because you have your happy butter dish and your happy creamer or your happy mug and your happy plates. You put some little flowers in there. You yes. know, it doesn't have to be a creamer. I don't drink coffee. I don't oh, use creamers, yeah. but I put flowers in it. Yeah. For yeah. sure. Yeah. There we go. It's a great thing to have on a counter if you use if you use chopsticks all the time. You can put chopsticks in. It, you know, it's fun. Oh, that's yeah, another great idea. Yeah, Should I do another kitcheny thing. Well, yeah, yeah. I'm here, yeah. I know I have more things than you do today. Here, yeah. Oh, look at this trivet. Beautiful, isn't it great? And this it's is a great show. Turquoise, blue, green. <laughs> And it looks like real, like they used like a real leaf to make those impressions. I swear it's so good. Yeah, yeah I'm sure of it. It's impressed. It's made by Cook's Club or it's distributed by Cook's Club. See, that's the thing. We don't know who made it, uh, but we know that they put their little sticker on it and that's who sold it because that's how things work. Basically. Yes, yes. But it is a beautiful quality tile that can just be a standalone piece or you can actually set it and put your dishes on it on the table very spring very spring yeah okay so should i show something else show us something show us something I'm nervous i don't know what else there is okay all right so let's see um i like this i don't know if it's oh. still there okay um, fringe yeah, it's a I buy a lot of their thing. mugs. Oh, yeah. They'd have just I, some really fun patterns and things. There it is with the paper in it. Oh, much better. Yeah. Oh, that's so you gorgeous. Can really see. It's gorgeous. It's that's really gorgeous. gorgeous. I mean, it's so well done. And it's another, like, it's a delightful, happy, cheerful. I mean, for me, spring is like, how do you feel when you wake up in the morning? How do you want to set the tone for the whole day? You know? Yeah. And you want to like, that's why I have my happy plates and I will never tell, I will never tell the plates that I use, <laughs> but I, I think of them as my happy plates <laughs> and, this I, uh, is like, you know, it's perfect. I have a you thing can, for peacock feathers. I have them all over. Yeah. I mean, this would be great in the, and you could put it in the bath and you could put cotton balls in it so you could really see it or Q-tips or, you know, something like that. Right. But it's also just, it's, it's a great kitchen item and it has its original old ta tag on like paper like before it really is vintage nice you know okay so since you just said cotton balls i have to show something <gasps> oh no i bet i know what you're gonna pull oh i put it up here and it's 
It's several I pieces, love, so I have to be careful. I can't believe you are selling this. I thought I you know. Keep it's been in my bathroom for a while, and it's getting crap. <laughs> so it's, and I thought, oh my gosh, it's you know, it's spring. And but this is what someone did. Now this is a princess house apothecary jar. Look, it's you don't have to have colored cotton balls in it. You can put oh. whatever you want in it. But that's what someone did. They used these yummy spring colors and made it fun. And it is etched. I don't know if that's coming through, but there is the, you know, the princess house etch. Yeah. It's in there. Can so see delightful. It. I'm really happy with our show right now. This is like such a fun, charming, cheerful. It's the colors. Yeah. Oh, oh Kelly's the young here. Colors. Hey, Kelly. Yeah. Yeah. What else you got? What else do I got? <laughs> uh I got I got oh can we talk can we talk can we talk egg cups I know Easter is like next Sunday and I was really bad and I did not get all of these listed anywhere you're seeing them for the first time literally just got them in the shop 30 minutes ago um but some of you might have remembered me buying these let me show you the best one first the jadeite yes. now I have two of the jadeite i can't uh, remember if these glow or not I'll tell you the truth oh no if fenton fenton doesn't normally glow in their jadeite uh, i think um hazel atlas and anchor hawking are the glowers but fenton doesn't glow anyway these are selling for like 70 80 bucks out there so i do yeah. have them reduced a bit and Something I will do at the end of this sale. I had fun with this last time. We get towards the end and I've got some of these things left. We may do a little make me an offer action. Yay. Oh, well, yeah. I could participate in that too because I have things I couldn't get in because I got the hour oh, wrong. There you go. So, All yeah. right. So they I have wonderful. two of the jadeite. And then I have two of the pink and it, oh. the picture is not doing it justice it is that opalescent pink can you see it yes is that what they call the fire at the top yes we can definitely hold it just like we can see it yeah yes it's yeah it's amazing and they were they're marked with the the signature uh scripted f on the bottom it's very very hard to see but it's there i mean i feel like that's something you can you don't have to use that just for easter you don't you know I don't like if, bunnies. yeah but it was crazy because i found those so i'd already done my research on the value and then a completely different store a completely different time amazing i found these <laughs> wow and I have six, I have six of these guys wow. in the cobalt blue. I mean, they're farmhouse to me. They're not just Easter. Correct. You know? Yeah. And they're Fenton. You know, they're, they're collectible. Yeah. They will hold their value. So yeah, so it was fun. It was fun finding all these. And I'm just mad at myself. I'm like, Danny, Easter's like next week. I will get these out the door on Monday. If you buy an Easter item, it's out of here. I Definitely. will give it to you before Easter. <laughs> yeah. And then I found these. Oh, yeah. Uh, let me find them in this my This is neck. a great show. There they are. These are Grace's Teaware, and they are bunny I egg cups, that. brand new in the package. It says they're dishwasher and microwave safe. Those are very realistic bunnies. Oh, so sweet. I heard they sweet. Wait, really? Let's like, let's not have a little plastic glare there. And there's two different patterns. So there's one of the bunnies is, whoops, holding oh. eggs. Oh. And one of the bunnies is holding little, little flowers. I love. And they're pink on the inside. Oh, lovely. I know you like pink. Yes. Never been used. Okay, I, have, I have this not for sale. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's cute. He's, a, he's, like a, 
That's like yeah. a hamster. He's wearing bunny ears wrapped around his head. Look, they're wrapped around with a ribbon. I love him. On. Or he could be a guinea pig. Oh, yeah. Anyway, I just love him. He's so oh. cute. <laughs> Not for sale. He's part of my decoration. He's teasing you guys. <laughs> She's just teasing you. He makes me happy. <laughs> Trying to catch up on our chat over here. The bunny oh, egg cups, they're so cute. Nancy's laughing. All right. Yeah. So show us something good. Okay. So I'm going to go straight. Well, I'm just going to show this real fast. I don't know who got it, but somebody snagged this immediately. The oh, uh, Attitude cute. Onion. Uh, Fitz oh, Floyd. Hold Howard, right? Fitz Employed. Oh, it's Fitz Employed. Okay. There you go. Love it. Love the attitude. Seriously. It's like. And then. Um, Let's see, what can I do? Uh, let's see, what's, uh, oh, how about, how about this? Okay, I made this. Ooh, oh, I saw you buy this. I yeah, saw you people, buy this. a lot, I didn't know I was going to list it, but a lot of people, a lot of people said they wanted it. So I thought, I was like, I don't know, let me think about it. You know what I mean? Because I'm still unsure. So I made it 50. I don't know if that's the right price or not. When I did the comps, the ones that were in chimps were like 175 up. And, you know, this one's chipped. But it's still so gorgeous. I've got a lot of chipped stuff. <laughs> the fern and, I mean, it's really got like the violet flowers, which is like that color that, you know, in the greens, the different greens. And the ferns are so great. So anyway, I fell in love with it. Like I spotted this at that flea market under stuff, behind a boom box. Like, like there was this much of it showing. And I, you know, and I was like, ooh. So I, you know, so anyway, so that's available. There were people asking about it. I think I made it a fair price for what it is and for how beautiful it is. All right. Yeah, and I don't absolutely. think... And it the chips don't affect the like it's still strong and you know what I mean it's still it's okay, so so I have that, and I have this little adorable thing. I know I'm, I should go one at a time, but well well it's just a sneak peek. That's gonna come up, okay? Your turn. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm making some adjustments here so that I can oh. see the chat at the same time and. My computer's doing something weird. What just happened? James says, even Majolica is going up in value. The Roseville. Oh, I yeah. Did you find a blender? Oh, hey, Joanne. I did. I, find, I got a blender a while ago. Wow, you must be watching the old videos. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for watching the old videos. Were you were you missing a blender? Because I don't remember I was, that one. There was a whole bunch. There was this whole like there was like a month's worth of videos at least. Where in every video I was like, I need a blender. I was going to estate sales last summer, and I was like, Where's my blender? Someone's got to have a blender. But I didn't want just any blender. I wanted like a really good blender. You know. You wanted a bougie blender. Yeah. Okay, I think I got. I'm this. just gonna hold this like this. Sorry, I think I got it figured out now because I want to be able to see the chat. And I got to be able to put this stuff up. So absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. I think I figured it out. I think I got, I got the happy, the happiness here. Also, um, if somebody can write in the chat, so the people in the chat see it to make sure their red line is all the way over to the right. Um, because if we say it, they're still not going to hear us say it for a while. There's some people that are, are, I think a bit delayed. Gotcha. Now yeah. this will be, I'm going to see how this, like, let me, let me see, let me show something. Okay. All right. Um, you no, know, were we going to change our little layout on this? I don't know. Just, I don't know. we were going to, but I don't have the option in here. Never mind, Cause I don't have the option right here. Anyway, <laughs> where are you little firefly? Oh, then I know. Hi, I Amy. Oh. Didn't hear that. Um, I just think this is the coolest thing. Now, obviously, it's not a real mason jar. I mean, it is, but it isn't. And uh, it's open. It's made to hold the candle inside. Put it out on your, put a citronella candle, like, out on the patio table. 
you know, to have a little picnic-y thing kind of going on there. This yeah. is my last one. I sold several of these. And uh, you can hang it. Like you can yes. find, you can hang it from like one of those planner holder thing. You can do fun stuff with it. Yeah. Very sturdy. Very sturdy. Yeah. Uh, but your your little vase that you showed momentarily uh, made me just realize this one. I've been having so much fun unboxing stuff that I haven't seen in like forever. Isn't that net? That's the one nice thing. Hold on. Yeah. Let me find her. Okay. This... The one nice thing about getting all your stuff in one place. Oh, I love her. She's the real deal. Oh. She's the, she's the one that like Opal House and some of the places have made the replicas of. She's the real deal. She's the Yorn Windblad. Did I spell it right? Oh. Yeah. W-I-I-N. Oh. It's from Denmark. There you go. You see her there. And I have her priced conservatively. I mean, these are highly, highly collectible. If you know, you know. Um, but know. yeah, she fabulous. You know, you could put um, like a planter in there. Like it could be like, it doesn't have to be a real plant. Like you could do a faux yeah. cactus or a jade plant. How cool would a jade plant be oh. coming out of her? <laughs> oh. Or a little like pea pods, whatever those things are called. Yeah. Um, I bought a, I have a, a face vase thing. And I bought a, a wool hat from you a long time ago. That's like very fuzzy. Someone made it. All oh, yeah, yeah. Anyway, I put that on mine and it looks so good. And it's oh, like my little put together art piece. Yeah. She's so happy. She's cheerful and happy. Exactly. Hi, Lizzie. All right. So, but yeah, you made me remember that I had her. So there she, she could hold washcloths. That's a fantastic idea. That's oh, a fantastic yeah. idea. For sure. Or if we still used guest soaps, soaps, <laughs> but who does that? We don't do that anymore. But yeah, or you know what? Not even guest towels. Like if you have people that come all the time, like I stopped, I stopped using guest towels. I buy the paper ones now and leave them out that are disposable. I just feel like when I go to someone's house, I don't want to use their guest towel. I want to use like the thing that you get, like if you go to a nice restaurant and they put, they put it on the counter and it's, oh, right. you know, and so I have that set up, but you could easily use something really charming like that and put those in there. Yeah. You know? And I just want to mention because, uh, because Julie is over here in the chat. So uh, if you guys aren't already following one way vintage, here on YouTube, uh, she has a channel. She is a a thrifter picker, um, um, very good friend of mine. She is going to be joining us here at the Knit Shopping Network very soon. Um, be watching for that coming. We're starting. We're getting to the point now. We've got the technology figured out. We're going to be adding some some new faces for you guys yes. to shop with. Yes. Yes. So on the videos on our independent channels are kind of like your little sneak peek on what's coming too. Yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> Definitely. Okay. So I'm going to show something actually that hasn't made it into a video that's out yet, but it will be coming out Ooh. soon. This, oh. this is so nice. Um, I, I, you can't tell from that picture. It's an object de art, right? Oh, yeah. It's beautiful. Or, or a paperweight or whatever. It's got a point on it. Like, it's a nice, it's, it's got a unique shape. Anyway, it's beautiful. It's one of those things, again, like, what makes you happy? What kind of tone do you want to set for the day? You know? There yeah. it is. And then there's the bottom. And it's not signed. I did, it's coming up in a future video. I did find it thrifting. I expected it to be signed Waterford or something like that. And it's not, but it's really super, super high quality. Did you look like you looked really, really close. I mean, it almost looks like a Swarovski. You know, I'm thinking like um You've only got that at $25. Holy yeah. smokers. Well, I got a really good deal on it. So uh, but I, I think it might be um Rosen. No, Rosenthal is etched, right? It feels like Rosenthal. Usually. Usually. But Rosenthal it also maybe etches. Olay Cassini then, you know. The Ole Cassinis, those. Oh, maybe. I think it's better though. It really, it does feel better. There's, yeah. It's there's, 
Well, there's oh, not a geez. bubble or, or, you know, it's gorgeous. And for me, this is yeah, not so much a paperweight as a tablescape. No, I don't like that. No. Tablescape, everyone. So there you go. No, I don't like that either. Never mind. I have, if you, if you, uh, <laughs> I'm just playing. If you, I know, if you want to get ahead of the line, I do have something crazy coming up with the jewelry. <laughs> Should I just show a sneak peek? And sure. then I need to, um, I don't know, I need to, to be right back. Okay. Um, <laughs> let me fix it so I can see comments again. But this is, that is a sneak peek of something special. Danny didn't even see it. Oh my God. Let's wait, 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 wait. Oh my goodness. What? <laughs> okay. So that's what Dawn does instead of jars. Like, you know, this is everything that I wasn't sure what to do with that I thought maybe I'd make a lot somehow. And I just kept hanging it on this hanger. And now um, I, I, I bundled it all together for a hundred dollars and there's wearable, there's gemstone and there's what? Stuff. <laughs> okay. There's made there's, it's all vintage. There's nothing new. I don't think so. All right. Well, you have shown paperweights. I'm going to show paperweights. I like, thank you for giving me the, the segues into what's next. Awesome. Um, I have two of these, so two people can snag this. Look at this oh. beautiful orchid. It's kind of like a, the Matt's uh, Jonathan pieces. This is not signed by anybody, mm -hmm. um, but it is of that caliber. It's like the intaglio where it's, you know, indented in the back so that it looks three dimensional from mm -hmm. the front. Mm -hmm. So there's two of those available. And. Oh, let me find. I love that. This one. Now they made this very interesting. It's definitely. <clears throat> happy too. It's got very quality controlled bubbles. See how it goes from small to big and a spiral. That is really hard to do. And then they added this silver mirroring that gives it kind of this aura effect you know, with a little bit of color, like a rainbow iridescent, but that's, it's all clear glass and that is coming from this mm. mirrored base. Gorgeous. That's how they have done that. that. Oh yeah. It's making, it's doing a chrome, chromatic, mm -hmm. uh, holographic. That's awesome. Yeah. Be it's a, that's beautiful. I'm that surprised is, you didn't keep that one. Well, you can't eat glass. You can't eat glass. <laughs> Okay, I want to show something else. Let's see, what haven't I showed? I've showed the peacock jar. I showed the majolica, showed the faceted. Uh, okay, okay, here is something cute. Um, oh, that is cute. It's oh, is 3D. it kind of like that decoupage kind of paper it's dimensional? It's, yeah, it's 3D. It's from the yeah. Store. Um, uh, people told me in the comments what it was, um, but it's, uh, it's an artist made and it has, it's like, uh, info there. It's from the UK. It's the Daisy fairy. It's in this sort of like shadow box room. She's three dimensional. Okay. I did comps on this and they went up from here. This was the low, low, um, this is where they started. She's fabulous. Yeah, I think I think she's wonderful. Very spring cheerful to me. And also I like that she's a UK artist. You know. Mm -hmm. um, and it's really well done. Let me see if I can get it closer. Is it working? Is it working? It Here. Is. Stand by. What is she doing? She's. Oh, I'm bigger now. Okay. It's also the ring light. There you go. See that? Look how pretty. Okay. Those blasted ring lights. It always mess with us. See? See what it does is it switches us around when I do that. <laughs> oh, interesting. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't have any art today. But 
I found this in my stash of stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh, first impression was it looked like a Hadley. Oh, I love that. You have beautiful it. things. That's I think it. you're in your element right now. I think this is your, this is, <laughs> this is really where you shine is this kind of happy, lovely. I just, because of this stuff that, you know, we came upon our, our little, uh, tagline honestly because that's how i shop i look for things that bring me joy yeah you no know, i'm not i'm not a labels girl i mean the maker's nice it's good to know that information but truly it's like it can be the best maker in the world and if i don't like it i don't like it but it can be a nobody and i'll go oh right you know. it could be like a little crocheted carrot like i still <laughs> can't believe you didn't buy the crocheted vegetables i love yes. this <laughs> Yeah. Uh, so look at it's like watercolors on the inside. It's just absolutely stunning, and it's huge. Like I'll give you a measurement here. Um, and they call it a salad bowl. Uh, you know, the original tag is is still kind of on there. I can't find this one out there anywhere. All right, you ready for this? It is ten and a half inches in diameter and four inches tall. You could put a lot of salad in there or pasta or, or make it into a bird bath or make it into a bird bath. I like the way I, you think. It would be gorgeous. Right? Yeah. Oh, you know what? It kind of, I kind of like where you're going with that. It would be gorgeous. And I know I, I, I normally do this. This should have been uh, listed in such a way that nothing else could ship with it. So hopefully somebody doesn't buy like, a whole bunch of these things. Oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> I may have to go fix that. Um, okay, so I do need to uh, leave the set for a moment. Okay. And then when you come back, I'm going to go fix a couple things so that that okay. doesn't happen. All right. All right. Let me show. I have a few of these little orbs. Let me find the first one. I called them, called them ornaments because they do have like an ornament hanger. But they're not, you know, specifically like Christmas time things. People use these all year long, like a sun catcher, hang it in your window, someplace where it can catch the light and be pretty. Um, I just, I called it light cranberry because to differentiate it from the other one that I have that I'll show you in a moment. So this is the light cranberry and it's all blown glass and it measures a large uh four inch diameter so it's good size it's like the whole whole palm of my hand size it's not small so there's that one we call the light cranberry and then this one is what i call the dark cranberry and you can see it is a darker cranberry pink as you can see there same size just a really, just pretty, just pretty pieces of glass. Put those over yonder. And then I have, where are you? Where are you? There you are. This one is Kegel, I think they call it. I hope I'm not saying that wrong. Let's see. Let me pull it up here for you. Yes called a kegel glass ornament this one is not quite as big i'm gonna i'm gonna say this one's about three to three and a half inch diameter but it's got the little the mottled pink and white pattern going there and the hanger is glass on this one so there's that and last but certainly not least sorry guys i gotta put this stuff or it's safely not gonna roll away this is not an ornament. This is uh, like a like a diffuser. So you'd put like a wick in there and put some scented oil and it would kind of diffuse the scent into your your room, if you will. But look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, all blown glass. 
I would love to watch one of the, something like this being blown to see how they get that veining because it's just spectacular and it's pink. It's exquisite. I brought, I brought out know, the pink today. You know what? You do need the full screen. It's exquisite. Yeah. But you could use it as a vase too. If you're not into like in my house, we don't do candles. We don't do scents. You could put a little stem in there and, and make it a vase. Oh, okay. Come back, Dawn. Come back. Hi. <laughs> hi. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> Oh, you love the butterfly in the back? We'll get to that. Kugel. Did I say? Okay. It's Kugel. Kugel. I say things wrong all the time. Kugel. Isn't that like um, something that you have on Thanksgiving? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> or Easter. Oh, oh, yeah. Right, right, right. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I get it. I get it. <laughs> yeah, James. I can't imagine it's easy to do that design. And... I think glass is underplayed for now. There's ah, kitty Sing, kitty, Danny. sing something, kitty kitty kitty. <laughs> I, I think there's a lot of what we call mass marketed glass out there. A lot of the imported from China, and the generations now are not really learning the difference. So I, you know, my kids, my kids all know the difference, but when you get a piece in your hands that is done with that quality and that workmanship, it's like, oh, okay, this is not, you know, a, a $10 piece of glass. This is a $50 piece of glass. Yeah. Learning the yeah. Difference because there is a difference. Google next word for your giveaways. I do have some giveaway. Can I give a sneak peek of what I'm giving away today? Oh, absolutely. You have Edgar's full attention. I have things to give away today. Okay, I, I am going to give away this little guy. He's this little East Germany little wooden duck because, I mean, he just, he's missing a little something. So I'm just going to, I'm going to just put him into a new home today. Uh, and then I have this really cute little box. Oh, I you know? love that. That's a great giveaway. That's yeah. big. That I goes got, into a big box. That's a very generous giveaway. I got that today. And then I got a couple more things, but there's your teases today. Okay. All right. So let's see. What do I have? I have this pretty thing. Um, you kind of segued into it. You can see it there, but this is it. Oh. Oh, okay. I love this. It's got a terracotta uh, yeah. base. It's glazed. And then they glazed over the terracotta. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's called Emerson Creek Pottery. It's an iris vase. That's beautiful. And it looks like a watercolor. Yes. Isn't that nice? Signed. Does it have a date? This? No date. I'm not seeing a date. It says Emerson Creek Pottery, Bedford, Virginia. Oh, it does have a date. I think it says 89. I was going to say it's 90s. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. 1989. Japanese Iris, L. Rothweiler saying. I bought this for me before I uh, like was, you know, doing anything online. You know what I mean? Um, I did thrift it for myself. Um, it and now it's time. A personal enjoyed by Dawn item. Yeah, and it's time, you know. I yeah. love it. It's be it's a beautiful object. It really it is, is beautiful. There's, there's not. I mean, it's just lovely. Yeah, yeah, and it's a great size. Great size. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. And then from there, which is kind of elegant and lovely, I go straight to Kitsch. But you go do you do something first? Oh, teased with straight the to Kitsch. Yeah. Yeah, and I have something that I forgot to bring in. So I'm going to, I'll show another item, but then I, there's something I have to go get. Okay. Let's All right. first just enjoy this. Oh. Now I'm saying Murano style because I can't verify that he is in fact Murano. He's got the Bulacante. He has got the multiple colors and techniques. He is clear based. 
Um, but I just haven't been able to verify 100% that he's Murano. So I'm calling him Murano style. Uh, but he's he's really fabulous. Uh, he measures, or she, which whichever you wish. The happy um, pig. Who's the happy pig? Four and a half inches long by three inches tall. So not a tiny pig. It's some pig. Okay, who knows that movie reference? Come on, tell me in the some chat. Some pig, Charlotte. Oh, you were supposed to let them guess. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> yep. Charlotte's web. Some pig. Yeah. See, I think he, I think this is where his pontal is. So the pontal is actually underneath the tail, and then they applied the tail after. Boop. It's to keep Sweet. it real. I but he's it. got he's got a venturine in there too. I don't know if you could see that. Like silver sparkly aventurine. It looks his, really well done. I mean, my castle. untrained eye, you know, I always learn from you with this sort of thing. I think you should show it full screen because I want to hear, I want to really learn this. And see his eyes are little Millie Fiore canes. That star is actually in the cane of glass. And they make a little slice, you know, and then put it on there and working with glass is just, it just, it's fascinating to me that somebody could say, I wouldn't have the patience <laughs> to do all these different pieces that have to be done to make a piece like this. Every single bubble had to be individually put in there, each bubble. And then they have to do it in such precision. And it's amazing. It's just amazing to me. So there he is. Now, what do I have to go with that pig? I have another pig. We'll go a complete opposite direction with this pig. Oh. <laughs> he is like just a folk art pig. Let me find him. Where are you? It's like a canvas. Holy smokes. Oh, Where Christy got there him. Is. Christy got the pig. Yay. Uh, but he is like a starched. Uh, like a like a almost like a starched linen is what I want to say and then he's been painted and put together wow. and he's just great look at his little look at his little curly tail oh that's a fabulous find <laughs> he did a, he did a I see thing. now this I feel like you must have gotten out of your storage or something because I don't remember this at all and I feel like I never would have passed up something like this, this I am I am opening a lot of boxes of stuff out of my storage and uh, yeah. what I did is I went I've got them on shelves in my garage and I went out there and I'm like, that's spring. That's spring. That's oh, spring. So this show is things. bringing me so much joy. I have to tell you. You're seeing things people haven't seen for either for a very long time or never. Cause you know, yeah. I'm, somebody I'm, got something. Let's see. Oh, the orders, there's, there's a whole bunch of things. I've been okay. doing the video since 2000, December, 2019. So really, you know, like 2020, and so things that I bought before then, you know, nobody's seen. They're, they're coming out of boxes now. Oh, that's exciting. Oh, and that was before it got really crazy. So you probably, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. Okay. Oh, the paperweight is gone. The flower fairy is gone. The, uh, oh, the lucite owl is gone. I was going to show him next. He's the pure kitsch. Well, okay. You can still show him. You can still show him. I have two pieces of kitsch. So, all right. James, you get anxious if the toothpaste does not go on the brush fast enough. This is the kitschier one. Oh, I love it. You're going to set me up for my next item. So, okay. All right. So then I'll, because uh, I, I have another, because I have another thing that's kind of less kitschy than this, but still kitschy. So I, th this, I have, I'm very sentimental towards these. I, yeah. I had this in my room. Like mm -hmm. I loved it. I chose it. It was probably something like, not this particular one, but. It's one of those that just pulls at you. You know what yep. I mean? Like this was probably one of the one that I had. It was probably like the first thing I was able to buy is like Dawn's decorating her room. Look at the little the little lady. Like, you know what I mean? So and it probably glows like the Dickens. And and they're fabulous. Like these have a real kind of cult following. They look really good in modern decor done with like a sense of humor, you know. So yeah, it's pretty fabulous. So that is gone. Can I just 
Can I just show mine that kind of oh, goes in I that same, that. same little that? era? Wait, is that that's glass though, right? No, lucite. That's lucite. Yep. Okay. Let me find it. Okay. <laughs> I can't help myself. Here it is. I need that in my life. Oh, are you trying to? <laughs> I really love it. Isn't it great? I mean, this, this is so nice bad. little simple thing. Add and two cards. Oh, God. Why, wait, stop. Add two, is it gone? Uh-oh. Do I have to go find you another one? I think it's gone. <laughs> no, here it is. Add two cards all right yep so there's that okay now i want to see your other kitsch thing and while you're showing your other kitsch thing well can i complete my purchase please? oh you can <laughs> <laughs> sign in to create an account oh no oh what do that oh what's it doing it's it's because i'm doing because i never shop from my phone i'm so paranoid oh phone oh uh, all right I do everything from my phone. Okay, how am I going to do this? I I'm so stuck on. Uh, someone's going to grab that. I'm feeling the pressure. Okay, guys, don't don't grab it. <laughs> I'm really feeling the pressure. Okay, hold it up again. Put the thing up there. It's like Don's personal shopping now. Wait, I'm going to do. I'm going to do, do something for show. you. Hold on. Stand by. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Okay. Oh, oh you, you, you took I it out of my door. friend. Thank I you. I have just, I have just put it out of out of sale, so nobody can snag it from you. You can take care of it later. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> thank you so much. I can breathe now. I really want <laughs> that. It's gonna go behind me. It's gonna look so good. I love it. I love yeah. like a little, little okay, thing. Okay, so back the there. next, the next, is it my turn? It's your, your turn, and I'm going to okay. go get something that I forgot to bring in here. Okay. All right. Okay. Thank you, everyone, for understanding. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> well, no, I mean, I just saw it, James, and I was like, I, I you know how it is. I, I am, um, I, yeah. I, and the other thing is, is that when I, I, a video that's coming out next week. I saw something very similar in uh, like an antique center and it was, um, uh, it was, I forget how much it was. It was like $75 or something and I wanted it so bad. So now I'm happy. Um, I did not get it because that day that I went there, I was, I found out about my car, you know, the whole thing. So I didn't get it. And now that one, I have that one. I think I like that one better. I have to uh, complete purchase. So this is what I'm going to show next. This is less kitschy than the owls, still kitschy in my book. It's, uh, do, do you guys remember this? Oh, let me show you. Let me get it up there. Here it is. Okay. The Baldelli Pottery Vino Carafe. Okay. This is the authentic one from the 1970s. This is the real deal. You don't have to use it as a wine craft. I'm sure people did. I think I witnessed that in my life. Um, yes, you know how it is. Yeah. So, oh, look. Do, do, do. You can hear it echoing. You can hear it echoing. So I come back and you're like breathing into a, a wine <laughs> A giant wine craft. craft. Okay. We'll go. <laughs> oh. Yeah. No, but isn't it cool? It's so 70s. Like, this is the real thing. I remember this. So, and I love the colors, you know, and it, this would look great in a kitchen again, like put some flowers in it, you know? Oh, they made me think of, yeah, okay. You can buy your own flowers. <laughs> yes. I'm reading the chat. I'm reading the chat. I can buy my Lucite flowers. <laughs> <laughs> love so it. Yeah. Oh, 83 likes. Awesome. Well, let's see. What do I have that kind of goes with a uh, a vino carafe? Oh, uh, I know. I've been supplying. Let's see. Let's see. I have such a variety of stuff here. I'm telling you. You know, we'll we'll go someplace different. We'll go someplace different. We'll go with a little mushroom action here. That's gorgeous. Oh, that's gorgeous. It's actually a vase. So, like a flower frog, it's got. 
Oh, and, the, okay. and the stem is hollow. So your stem kind of sits down in there. I have two of these. They're very dainty glass. So there, I have two of the yellow. And I have one of the orange. Oh, so fun. Danny. Danny, you are crushing it today. This is fantastic. What a great I bought these collection. for my daughter. Uh, who has now told me, Mom, I can't have everything mushroom. Oh. I swear, she is the hardest person to like get in a groove no, I of finding that, gifts though. for. I so did I, I? I've told the owl story before, right? So my mother know. had an owl. She did something where she had an owl, and it was like great. She liked the owl. She brought the owl home, and then her kids were, you know teenagers right so we got her an owl. i got her an owl oh the first thing i ever got for her i was 10 i went to the five and dime myself and i got a little pewter app uh, uh, owl and i gave it to her and then she got another owl for herself and she put it on the end table by the couch she had a really beautiful like bauman coffee you know coffee table and end table and she put this great owl on it, it was made out of shell very 70s so the owls started coming in because, oh, mom likes owls, right? And so it became this like default. That's how it happens. The owls. And <laughs> one day she was like, no more owls. I never really liked them that much. I liked the one owl. <laughs> and I've told you the story with my grandmother and the cows, right? Yes. It was the same thing. She worked at the Alpha Beta um uh bakery dairy thing warehouse and she was given a cow as kind of like a funny gift like working in the dairy department and you, you know like it. yeah and because of the kind person okay you have to understand you walked in her house and there was this big opening and it was like a divider between the living room and the dining room so there was like this ledge and she put it prominently so you walk in her house, you see the cow. People go, oh, she likes cows. Yes. Her house was filled with cows by the time she passed. Yes, that's how it starts, right? So. But she's the reason I named my, my business Utterly Good. Oh, that's sweet. In honor of my grandmother. I did not know. I did not know that. I thought it was the, um, the goats. Well, the ghosts played a big part because udders were a part of my life, but yeah. I always made my logo a cow. You know, oh, yeah. That was my meme. <laughs> thank you for the hearts, everybody. <laughs> yes, thank you. <laughs> oh, you got the orange mushroom vase? That was pretty. That's nice. Beautiful. All right. Well, hey, what do we got next? Uh, okay, so I have uh, I have something. Uh, where oh, Where'd it go? Okay, I'm not going to do the big lot yet. I'm going to wait on that. I have a cute little thing, and then I have jewelry after that. Okay. Okay, so that is the mark on this little china set. Look how petite. I just think it's charming and delightful. It's it two, little, two little cups, right? They're little flowered cups. There's better pictures. If you want to scan it, you can see the pictures pretty well there's the little uh whatever that is i guess it's like it's not a, a teapot sugar. it's like a little sugar little thing oh my gosh and i know it has a little thing and it's really china yeah and then yep. um the little... i think it says occupied japan on there too so we know specifically the period in the 1940s where that was produced how fun oh that would be good for a fairy garden Absolutely. It felt spring to me, right? And I, I, <laughs> what are they what making? Are what are they doing? Wait, what? She says she went to the gastroenterologist and it turns out she actually can eat jewelry. <laughs> oh, Christy. Oh, perfect. Sign <laughs> <Find> me up. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that was good. I like that. So there you go. That is in the little shop. 
in my little shop, my little spring china. And then after this, this is the last thing. And then after this, it's uh, some jewelry. Excellent. Yeah. Well, I don't have any jewelry today. Oh, just, wow. I just have stuffs. Uh, let's see. Let's go Italiano. How about we do that? Oh, gorgeous. You really are crushing it today. I got to tell you. You should just be like this all the time. This, I just want every single thing. It's all so joyful. It makes me, you know what, Danny? You know what I just realized? You don't have any edge. <laughs> what does that mean? You don't even know what it means. That's hysterical. Hand in the chat. Okay, the New Yorkers are all like, yeah, edge. We know what edge is. Sh should I be happy? Head. Should I be yeah, offended? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There's your little made in Italy. It's got oh, this really cool pink marble, you know, and then it's got like the gold <laughs> little Hollywood Regency esque kind of thing going. Yeah. I just found that in my stash. There's a little bit of wear on the gold handle, which tells you it was used. This was somebody's little dresser jar. Yeah. How cool it's is amazing. that? It's Stories beautiful. it could tell. Oh, beautiful. She is pure. She's so pure. Yeah. No edge. No edge. No edge. Okay. I got told today I'm not edgy. I don't know how I feel about that. You're not edgy. <laughs> and then this, I don't know. I don't, I think this is American. I love it. And we know it's from 1958 because wow. the artist signed it. Crazy. Anne Willy, Wiley, W-I-L-L-E-Y is the painter. And it's it's got texture. So it's like the gold is like it's raised. It's amazing. That's gorgeous. That's gorgeous. And I call it a pitcher, but it's not, it's more like a jug, you know, it's. I'm sure its original purpose was to be like a little jug, but wow. now it's just a beautiful vase. Yeah. Or a vase. Or a vase, right. You know, there's What's this the big debate about a vase and a vase. I know there's this big debate. You know, what's the difference between a vase and a vase? I really think it's just your your country of or, origin and dialect. Because I think it's the same thing, honestly. I joke around and say, what's the difference? About 20 bucks. Yeah. 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 I think it depends on where you're from. Yeah. I think it really does. Yeah. The P my mother's family said rubbish. They didn't say garbage. They said rubbish. Rubbish. There you go. Things like that. Tomatoes or tomatoes. Shall I show one more pretty piece? Oh, yeah. Found this in my stack. Oh, now, that's gorgeous, too. Oh, my gosh. Seriously, well, you, you should just do this forever. When you usually see rose bowls, they're like, you know, they're about yay big. That's the like, like the standard size of a, of a rose bowl. <gasps> oh. I know you can't tell from the picture. This thing is huge. That uh, is I do funny. believe it is a pear point uh, Mount um, Washington. It is Victorian. It is cased and frosted. Now, I left this on. So the cool thing about this, it's a piece of tape, like, like almost like the old medical tape. And it's been typed with a typewriter. Oh my goodness. Somebody put the detail. Now it's, it's long been worn, but you can see satin glass rose bowl and there's a circa and it's, you can't see it, but I left that on for provenance. This piece has been around for a very long time. Oh, yeah, that you just reminded me in one of your more recent videos, you picked up something and it had like a girl's name on it. And then a few minutes later, you picked up something else and it had another girl's name on it. And I realized that they were the ones who were supposed to get it. Oh, you know what I mean? Like this was going to Alice and this was going to Lily. You know what I mean? It was oh, one of those. Right. Yeah. I love when stuff has its original provenance and yeah, the story stories you know, behind yeah. it and all that. But just and, it, and that label was typed out with a typewriter. Typewriter, easy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's exquisite, though. 
It's a really how, cool piece. How do you not want to live with that? That's gorgeous. If this was blue, it wouldn't be going anywhere. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's like my cabinet's all blue. So it's gorgeous. I'm going to put her right back on the shelf here. Okay. Hey. All right. So, what you got? Uh, I have some bracelets. I, I was in the oh, midst of. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I was in the midst of loading some jewelry and I got a few pieces up and then I realized that I didn't have the hour that I thought I had. So <laughs> I have bracelets and I have a giant group. So you have them in your shop. You just don't have them loaded here. No, they're not there. Uh, there. I was taking the pictures. <laughs> so how are we, how are we selling those? Oh no, I have the bracelets and I have the big group. I there's other things. All I have is bracelets in a group. I'm sorry. Okay. I apologize. Okay, okay. So that's the back of this one. There's the back mm. of it. Very brutalist. Uh, totally. This is so cool. Yeah. This is vintage. This came from the um the estate of the woman where I got um where I ended up like getting the whole room full, you know, and she was the one who started like the the uh the foundation. I, I forget the name of it. It was like the foundation that was um Christopher Reeves uh it changed the name when Christopher Reeves had his accident. I can't remember the name of it. And um, and she did those galas and she was, you know, and she was like a buyer for like five decades or something. And it was that amazing house. And so this came from her. Um, and the cool thing is it's uh, it's from Greece. It's not it's not from China. It's true vintage. So and it's so brutalist and cool. I mean, fabulous mid-century, right? Very cool. Um, that, I have two of these, I think. Yeah, two of these. And then I have this whole little family. I have, um, I'm just going to show them. I have this one with the cutout. There's only one of these. Look how fun. This is what it looks like when it's closed. Okay, everybody, super adjustable. These are all from Greece. Look how cool. Look how cool. Love. And we have this one. This is the one with the spiral. Nope, that's not the one with the spirals. The back. That is this one. Very brutalist. Okay, you can see them all in the shop. And then that one is the spirals. I think this one is my favorite. I just have one of these. There's the back. Look how cool. With the spirals. And there's one more. And that's the one. Oh, the first one. <laughs> I confused myself. The, yeah, I showed that one. That's this one. Also like a Greek key, but solid. That's the back. That's the front. This, I love this one. This is, this really has a great look. This one looks very cool. Kind of brutalist mid-century. I see this. I know it's not spring to say with a turtleneck, but, and I made them all $25. So can't go wrong. Hey, and then, it's good for turtlenecks here today. Right? <laughs> yeah. So those, I, I had fun with those. I just listed them all for $25 you know, enjoy. And, um, and then there's a giant group, uh, that I just made a hundred dollars. It, it might be gone already. Um, because it was just an insane thing I did. I just was like, ah, oh, whatever. <laughs> so this is a good time to give a little tease for a sale that we're going to have coming up in a couple of weeks in honor of tax day. Yes. We're going to have an everything under $25 sale. Yes. So just mark your calendars. It's oh, I should Sunday. have. I could have. Seen, I could have. <laughs> oh well, <laughs> that whole lot of that would have been. You just got to find more stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Every once in a while, I just want to do something that I know everyone's going to go like, "Oh my gosh!" <laughs> like you know. So, oh, 105 likes. Fantastic. Yeah, they're not sterling. No, they're not sterling. They're they're plated. They're. Oh they're no, if those old. were sterling. Those would be. 
hundreds 250 of you know? <laughs> yeah yeah no they're old new uh they're vintage they're old new stock from greece they're pretty they're they're a cool little family of things nice yeah nice well this item actually i bought this a while ago but it never got listed i don't know sometimes stuff just falls through the cracks yeah. and then when i go to do one of these sales i'm like i look in my drafted because it was in a draft i'm like Wait a minute you never got pictures but here let's do it now um, oh, I love that let's, go little, let's go on a little blue a little blue journey so notice it says tea like tea oh look at that yeah so what language spells tea with t-e-e -E? dutch maybe is it it's the I blue know, onion. I'm just guessing because I know they like to repeat their, you know, AA and, and all, of, all of that. It's not a marked piece, but we do know it's blue onion. And it's just, it's a, I love the size of tea canisters. Me too. They're just perfect for stashing a little. Okay. Funny story. <laughs> when I moved last time, packing up my kitchen, um, I started opening like all my canisters and finding things I had forgotten that I'd hidden in canisters. Oh, hysterical. Oh, how fun. <laughs> oh, how fun. Because that's what I do. I hide things in canisters. Yeah, okay. Now everybody, anybody who's watching is going to come rob my house. You're going to go look at the canisters, right? Yeah. <laughs> I didn't say what it was. It could have been like dog treats. <laughs> yeah. Right. For me, it definitely would have been the cookies. You know, or the like I do hide things from little the hard candies, where there's yeah. In our house, I have to hide the I, I have to hide the gluten-free Oreos. Like, oh fun. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, that's something about you we didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> do you freeze them? They're so good. Frozen. Can you are the are the gluten-free ones good frozen? I love frozen. I've Oreos. never tried frozen. Oh my gosh. Don't I, my start. new favorite is the mint. Oh, I've been seeing those. I've been walking past them like really, really diligently. The, the mint is yummy. Yeah. I'm working out like again. So nice. there's that. Yeah. I'm not. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I kind of am. I like yeah. I'm on my feet, you know. You have the energy. Yeah. 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 You, um, you don't need to control your weight. That's for sure. <laughs> I, well, you know, it's funny. So just so everybody knows. Me being skinny, like, is because of yeah my condition. Like, I have Crohn's, so yeah, I I'm sure that if I didn't have Crohn's and the way I eat, we'd be yeah. working out together. Trust me. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. So don't be careful what you wish for because yeah. uh, this yeah. this comes Absolutely. with a cost. Yeah. Uh, but I bought this little set, and I was so excited when I found it, and. And then I was going to list them separately until I discovered that the other little piece, I'll show you, it's got a little piece of damage. Now, this piece does not have damage. This is why oh, I'm mystery them salt. together. What's that? Finish. It's finish. T-E-E -E is finish. Oh, it's finish. Okay. This is Hall's mm. Superior Quality Kitchenware. This is the Rose White. Rose White. And it's just a dainty little handle of flowers. So you're going to get, I call this a milk pitcher. Maybe it's not. I don't know. What do you guys say? It's almost got like an ice lip. That's what makes me second guess. But I think that might just be the design. But it's yeah. like, it's like milk pitcher size. It's elegant. Um, and then this piece oh. has a lid. And uh, when I purchased it, they had covered this up with the tape with the stuff so i didn't see it but it does does have a little damage to the little lid but other than that it's fabulous that's the only yeah. thing yeah so i'm going to sell them both together and Fantastic. this has a strainer in the spout which i thought was interesting yeah they're really meant to be used you know oh absolutely oh yeah, yeah. this was functional functional dinnerware Love. is functional dinnerware. They're, they're so elegant so you get you get both of them, two for the price of one. Amazing. Why would you ever go to Target? Honestly, think about it. I don't know. Yeah, I don't. Unless I'm with Jordan and she makes me. <laughs> <laughs> right. That happens sometimes. Yeah. In fact, my video that's coming out tonight, we go to the the Goodwill clearance bins. There's a brand new one in San Diego, and it was her first time. She'd never been. 
she found a couple things for the wedding actually, which was cool. And then, and it's really all about the clothes when, you know, when you go, yeah. so we got some clothes and then we went to home goods and I do a little like, you know, price comparison shopping of, you know, what you can find at like thrift stores versus what you can find at like home goods. And I but, love home goods. I mean, I feel like it has its place, you know, but I'd I, rather buy that set. I'd rather buy Hall Superior China than and the uh, new stuff. Yeah. Then, you know, one with the, the that came out of, you know, we don't know what kind of paint they use. Like, you know what I mean? Like, right. Yeah. Well, I mean, they do. They do have to put that warning on everything now. Yeah. Yeah. So there is that. Sorry, I just found tape schmudge on this guy, and this is really going to bother me. Oh, no. Okay, wait, I'm not going to show him yet. I'm going to clean him up before I show him. Too. Oh, the Greek key bracelet. Okay. Um, There are two. There is this one. It might be sold out already. I just, the, oh, the Greek key. I don't, I don't remember the quantity. So anyway, so I'll, I'll, there's that. You can scan. Oops. You can scan that. If it's still available, you can put it in the cart. And then there's the other one. That's not that one. Oh, it's this one. Okay. That's the back of it. That's what the, the front looks like. So you can scan. That's this one. If you want this one, scan there, okay, and see if it's still there. And then this is the other Greek key. If you want this one, scan there and check that link. And if it's still available, you can grab that. Perfect. Yeah. I said I was going to be on a blue kick. A blue kick. Oh. A new kick. A blue that? kick. There we oh, go. <laughs> oh, I love that too. I love everything. Oh my gosh. It's so much better when you hold it up. It's so unique. So it is a redware. It's fantastic. And the way they painted this, the redware comes through the colors. Let's see if I can see how it's, and it's meant to be that like, this is, this Artful. was the design and it is taller. Laguna Beach. Now, if you know Laguna Beach, California, you know, there's nothing in Laguna Beach that you can buy for under a hundred bucks. <laughs> yeah. And that's, that's being conservative. Um, but it is also one of my favorite places to go and visit because of the galleries and the arts and the artists that all are just congregate there. So um, this is a piece out of Laguna. Wouldn't it be great if we could figure out in our niche? I mean, we have a niche that's very different from that, but wouldn't it be great if we could do like special field trips where we go to places like that just to compare? That would be fun. Maybe we should, yeah. you know, put on I've done a, I've done a few minutes here and there after a video, like from a museum. Yeah. But yeah. Well. That's incredible. Yeah. Little, little, little sneak info is Dawn and I will be getting together soon. That's right. In a city that neither of us lives in, and we will be shopping and visiting. So maybe we can put, you know, some of that onto our. I would love that repertoire. We can, we can see what we can do. Yeah, a little road road trip filming. Um, but yeah, so that I could not resist this piece when I found it because it's. I wow. feel like that's a great price. Really, I love it. I love it. So when I was dating my first husband a long time ago. Um, one of the things that he'd always say, what do you want to do? I say, go to Laguna beach and look at the whale wall because they have one of the original Wyland murals. Like it's an entire side of a building is painted with a life-size whale. And I could just oh. sit and stare at that thing for, for hours. Like that was like, that was my dream day. Just take me to the whale wall. I, and, uh, I want to try and send this link okay so carrie the the woman who runs five acres uh-huh she just texted me she doesn't know i'm live oh so i'm gonna text her i'm live maybe she'll show up in the oh, chat very nice yeah okay let me i'm running out of spots here I'll put that over there um and then what let's see what else is in my blue nest here oh oh So 
uh, some oh, of you who follow me other places gorgeous. will recognize this piece that almost, almost got sold for 10 bucks. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, I was dying, but it didn't because they didn't know what they had. So <laughs> this is Murano glass. This is a most likely an Alfredo Barbini piece. Ooh. And uh, so the white can be tricky. Um, most of the reproduction pieces that you find will be the cased white because that is the easiest to do. But the difference between those and this is that this isn't just cased with white. This is cased with clear glass over white over blue. So you have a triple effect oh, there. Oh, fascinating. Casing, yes. And then even the blue has a bit of a, a summer so effect. Yeah, in it. that's what I would have seen. Also, the shape, it has an elegance to it that I think copies don't have. Am I wrong? Yeah, and a weight, a thickness, a uh, weight, a feel like, oh, just get your hands on it. It's just the most luscious glass. And also, I saw a copy once and I thought I could tell it was a copy because the blue wasn't as nice. Yeah. Does that make One sense? of the things you'll notice is it won't be as thick. It'll be much thinner. Yeah. And also, there's the blue is like more flat. Or something. I don't know. Yeah. When they use different colors. The other thing is when you're looking at the Pontal, let's see if this one's a little bit tough to see. You want to see little micro scratches. Mm -hmm. You absolutely want to see that because that is something that can only happen over time with it sitting on a shelf with dust. That's what causes that. It gets shifted mm -hmm. ever so slightly over years and years and years and it will make those little micro scratches on the bottom. And sometimes they're really, really scratched and people mistake that for being a cloudy bottom. That's not what we mean by cloudy bottom. It's a clear bottom that's just really scratched. So you learn to tell the difference in that and you'll see like, oh yeah, that is a fifties or earlier piece because that can only happen over time. You can't man make that and, and make it look realistic. So Carrie's here. Yay. <laughs> so, so there it is. There's that piece. And you're going back on the shelf over here. <laughs> it's right. beautiful. And right, well, I'm proud of you for selling. Show us something. Yeah, okay, you know I you can't one, eat glass. I yeah, right. I have one thing left. Oh, okay. If it's still available, I don't know. Here it is. Hold on, let me find it. Here it is. That is oops. I put not a jar. That is literally the picture of the, the thing that I just kept adding things to the hanger. Um, and I, had <laughs> it on, I had it on a coat rack. I had a hanger on a coat rack in my entry. What, what are they saying? No, I'm just, I love it. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. So it's I'm like gonna, a piece of art. I, yeah, well, you know, it was, it was fun to make. Like I just kept adding things to this hanger. It's a pants hanger that I had on a coat rack when you first walk in, right? So you get the idea. That is my wall behind it. And there, it's just all kinds of various things that okay, I wouldn't you get, full, you get full screen for this. I wouldn't necessarily auction this. It's very heavy. Um, so not everything is in perfect condition though. Like a lot, a lot of it is, and then some of it is not. I would say most of it is. Um, but there's, a, it's just, it's all vintage. It's some of it's really pretty. I like this bauble thing. Um, I would wear it with this. I love this one. Like this one, I could have, this I've, I've worn these two together. These two. It's just crazy. Um, and I, you know, shipping is included on this. So someone probably just got it. No, someone got a bracelet. So there it is. There's the back. There's more over there. There's these are handmade. All right. There's ugh. there's plastic in here. There's faux amber. There's a lot of glass. There's the handmade ones. Um, see, these are the uh, the handmade ones. Those those sell reasonably well. This is like pottery. This one. This is gemstone. This, I, I sold this and it came back because the rose 
chipped in shipping. So I took it back, but I could never really see where it chipped. I could see the little chip in the box, but I couldn't see it. So I don't, I don't think it matters that much, but anyway, so there's that. This is gemstone and it's too heavy to keep holding, but you, you get, you get all of that in a box. I'm sure that must be gone already. Sent out to you. Yeah. How could that not be gone already? Yeah, it's pretty great. That There's some really pretty great. things. There's some pretty things in there. Like a lot of it's pretty, honestly. Yeah. A lot of it's useful and a lot of it is you can uh, use for craft. I'm also. seeing a lot of people saying things about the video is glitching. And I've got it playing over here on another screen. So maybe it might be like a mobile thing. Um Hmm. I have it playing the entire. I have it. I have it going since we started. I haven't seen one issue on my desktop. Yeah. I mean, it's not I, a desktop. It's my laptop. I think it can be specific to areas with you know. There's a, there's a lot of stuff going on in our uh, little cyber web stuff yes. lately. Yes, and solar yeah. flares. That's what every time. People are like, solar flare is done. <laughs> yeah. So most people are saying it's fine. Yeah. So it could just be maybe an area that you're in. Yeah. yeah. So I, that's everything for me. I have a couple things that I meant to list that I can go grab if we want to do. And well, get them listed. Just don't take oh, a it's... picture. Do what I do. Put them in there. Show them. And then, then. Oh, without the picture. It's a little advantage for people that are here. Uh, okay, I'll go get some, some of the, they, okay. they were, I, I was just, stuff. I can show stuff while you're, I, ha I have a group of things that I was going to put in. I didn't get to. Okay. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to go through my list here and make sure I haven't missed anything. Uh, oh, my Arthur courts. I got Arthur court here. Let me bump that off of there right there. Okay. I have a couple of little Arthur court items, actually one little one big. This is bunnies. And again, I will get the Eastery stuff out. I will get almost everything out uh, by Monday, but I will prioritize anything with bunnies that will it will go out on Monday. Um, this is, I believe it, oh, it's 1994. Now I see, I put it as 1996, but now I see that it's 1994. Arthur Court, fun little bun bun dish right there. And then I have another Arthur Court. That is a bowl, and it is a 1981. So this is early. This is early Arthur Court, and the pattern is known as waves. And I see it now. At first, I thought it was flower petals, but you can see the waves on this bowl. Large size. Let me get you a, an actual measurement. Uh, 1981 on the back there. Let me tell you exactly how big it is. It's a 12 inch diameter and three inches deep. So again, lots of salad in that bad boy right there. So Arthur Court, very good brand. It's aluminum for those that may not know what the metal is. And let's see, oh, the butterfly. Someone asked about the butterfly that Timmy put said butterfly. I thought for sure this would fly out of the shop. I really, really did. I'm, I'm really like, if it doesn't sell, I'm going to, I'm going to hang this in my own backyard because I think it's spectacular. Look how big it is. Uh, it is a monarch butterfly, just painted wood. It's got two holes to screw it into like a fence post. I think it's a, just a handmade piece. Um, these fix here, there fixes a little antenna. I love this so much, but I was going to say you can't eat butterflies, but I am sure somewhere in this world, somebody eats butterflies, but <laughs> ooh. <laughs> anyway, um, it's great. If it doesn't sell, I, I literally am talking myself into keeping this one. So just saying. This is your last, this is your last chance. I won't take it down anytime too soon. Oh, let's see. What other bunnies do I have? Where's my other bunnies? I think I got all the bunnies except for this one. Okay. 
This is my other my other bunny item here. Let me bring the bunny up. Where's the bunny? Find the bunny. Bunny, bunny, bunny. Oh, goodness. There it is. This is by a company known as Greenbox. Uh, it's dishwasher and microwave safe. It's uh, designed by Kathy Walters. Kathy Walters has done. It's like a, just like a little trinket dish. And again, you know, if you love bunnies, it doesn't just have to be for Easter. I think. Oh, look, there was a segue because it's got butterflies. Hey, how about that? Okay. Um, oh, there was another piece of Murano that I went and I fetched and then I didn't show it to you guys. Let me find it. And can you've seen some of the imported uh, art glass flowers? And then there's this. Ooh. Oh, I love that. And oh, again, the most beautiful. look at the technique. Look at the colors. Look at everything that went into making this piece. Not your little standard, ordinary glass flower. I have mine that I will not part with, and yours is so much better. See the little aventurine in there? Yeah, this I I saw this in a case at an antique mall, and I like veered right to it because I'm like, oh, that is so pretty. Is it? Are they specifically for peonies? Are they? I don't know. Somebody somebody commented that they were for peonies because I found this one a while back and I got it and I really with no intention of not either. selling this. Yours is so much nicer. <laughs> But anyway, that's what I learned from comments on YouTube, that maybe it was peonies. So the other piece that I went and grabbed was the Pink Depression cake plate that also, uh, I cannot believe someone hasn't snagged it. Because it's very hard to find these big pieces anymore of anything. And there's not a freckle on it. It's yeah. absolutely fabulous. I don't uh, know what the pattern is. I wasn't able to find it, but it got like a laurel leaf around the edge. So we're talking, uh, you know, 1920s, probably. Wow. It has survived 100 years. 100 years. 100. Yeah. Do you know how many little lady parties this thing has probably been to and, and seen stuff? It's big. <laughs> you could put pedophores on it. You could put what? Pedophores. You said little lady parties, little finger sandwiches, little pedophores. Oh, oh but yes, of course. I know what you were talking about. <laughs> Nine inches diameter. Nine inches diameter. That's gorgeous. Yes. Put you up here. Okay. So what so, did you get loaded? Did you load some I, stuff? I'm, I'm, I don't, I don't want to load it. I want to end maybe, I don't know what to do. I, but I'm so excited because these are all the things that I wanted to get to and they're so pretty and springy. Um, like this one, that's, a. but you're going to upset people if they can't go buy it. So how do I do, can I entertain offers? Just go make the listing. Just go make the listing. And yeah, they, leave still, they still need to have a place to go buy it. Oh, without the picture. That's yeah. right. I forgot. Okay. Thank yeah. you, Danny. I forgot. Okay. I'm okay. learning. Go make I'm some learning. listings. Yes. And I'll show some more stuff. It's all good. Who do Lily Pulitzer made coffee mugs or tea mugs? Whatever you want to drink out of it. Uh, this one, of course, I veered to because of its blueness. There's the lily in there. There's the lily in there. Uh, lily Pulitzer is kind of known for these patterns on their fabrics. Uh, so it's one of the ways you almost can always tell a lily Pulitzer dress is because they have these fabulous prints. And this one is amazing. Amazing. Uh, so there's that. Oh, I've got 
two really nice little creamers. Let me show these to you. I'm like excited now to see what she's putting in the shop. That's going to be fun. See, that's one of the things that we can do is like you guys have the advantage now. Nobody can go buy it early. or I mean, they could, uh, but not knowing what it looks like from a picture, they're not going to. So that is your advantage when she ends up coming back and showing the item. Let's see. I have these creamers. I think I got these quite some time ago at Dog Junkies. One of my little shopping expeditions. Look how tall this is. And it's got these beautiful little pink flowers with the kind of an aqua blue borders. It is an, uh, it's marked only with a, a number. So this was not made for import or export, export, I should say. Um, that's when they have to like use the country of origin. Uh, it's just a nice little 1950s, probably made in USA creamer. So we have that. And then I have one that is Nippon. And again, this is early Nippon, not marked. It was before they were told you got to put your country on the bottom. It's a flow blue, which is very interesting. See the, see the edges. So this is a flow blue, but almost like a purposeful and then it's got the moriage, which is that little uh, beaded enameling that's got a texture to it. And it's all hand painted. Absolutely stunning, stunning piece. We've got that. I'm trying to like do like items because I'm looking over here and I have a cardinal. But I guess you guys don't care, right? We're good. We're good just like transitioning over to something completely different. Let's find my little cardinal here. Where, oh, where is my little birdie? Where, oh, where can it be? There it is. Uh, it's by Demdaco. Demdaco makes the willow trees. Uh, and it's by an artist named Dean Krauser. Now it's just meant to be like a little standing plaque. Be like the birds, sing loud and fly free. Uh, <laughs> it could be a paperweight. You can see this was a wholesale piece. That was the wholesale price on there. We have a company out, our company, a a what would you call it it's mm -hmm. it's like two ginormous buildings it's our world market trade center i guess i guess world market trade centers are everywhere um and they do uh once a year they have what they call a sample sale and that's when um these things are acquired so but that would have been a wholesale price for a company like hallmark or someplace to purchase that item so there he is and I have another Dean Krauser piece. Actually, it's a set, which I will find here momentarily. Here we go. I'm just going to bring one down and show it. It is, uh, it is a cup. Right, you're going to get a two. There's two. So it's dragonflies. Look at that. Absolutely fabulous art on this set. There is the saucer. There is the mark on the back. And the bonus is you also get a tea diffuser with it. So make your tea in a little matching tea diffuser. And then you have your, your cups to serve it in. Absolutely stunning, stunning pieces. You get the pair. Get in the pair. Okay, put that back up there. I have marked this little cutie down. This is a Martha Stewart berry strainer bowl. And, you know, spring is the perfect time for the eating of the berries. So let me find it. It's here somewhere. 
why is it, you know, I'm scrolling up this little list of stuff that I have, and I swear I've gone by this like 16 times, and then when I want to find it, it's not there. There it is. Okay. Boop. All right. So it's got the lovely little spring floral on both sides. It's a nice size. Let me just get you a measurement on that. Seven inch diameter, seven inch diameter and three and a half inches tall on a little berry strainer or just small colander. I mean, you, if you don't like berries, then you can strain your noodles in it too. So there we have that. Let me just see if I'm getting any questions over here. We are congratulating Nancy on, oh, the Cardinal. Fantastic. You'll love him. He's very, very sweet. I'm still packaging up uh, a bunch of your stuff from the other night. So I might be able to slip him into one of those packages and uh, refund you some shipping. I will do that if I can. Absolutely. Um, so that, I also have a little Franciscan tulip time. Oh, my page just bounced. Why did it do that? That was weird. Okay. Because I had it. I was just about ready to click on it and it and it like bounced. There it is. Okay. So I was selling these for $6 each and I decided I've got six left. And instead of ending up with an odd amount, I just decided I'm going to sell all six of the Franciscan Tulip Time bread plates all together for a discount. There's Yay. That. This is known as the TV Mark, 1970s Franciscan. Oh. They have a, a few little like utensil scratches on them, but they're still super fun and fabulous plates. I'm having so much fun right now. I can't even tell you. <gasps> well, can I give you the bird? <laughs> yes. I'll, thank you very much. <laughs> Oh, I'll send see. the label. <laughs> Where is this guy? I swear there needs to be a search function on here to just go to the proper item. Oh, James said you do unique, good quality items. Amazing. She's really in her wheelhouse. Like this, this is, she, this is great. You know what? For some reason, this isn't showing up. I'm going to have to go get him. Do you have something to show while I go get him? Oh yeah. I'm so excited. Okay, you show us. I'm going to go fetch him. Okay, here it is. No picture. This is what Danny taught me. Yes. Look, 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 look. This is old Coro Sterling. Look at the size of this. Now you'll make people happy because they can actually purchase it. <laughs> right. Well, I mean, I wanted, I was thinking about entertaining offers on this because it's so long. Mm. It's really, I mean, it's a long, it's unusual because it's long. It's, a, it's like almost four inches and it's gold over silver and it's in perfect condition. It's 1940s Coro. It's marked. Okay. If that doesn't go by the end of the show, I'm sure it will make it into an auction. Look how gorgeous that is. And the story with this was I saw this while I was editing and I couldn't believe I didn't get it. Mm. and so i went back and it was still there look, look look look! i'm not doing it justice oh and i don't i didn't bring my bust with me but uh here i'll put it i'll show it to you on actually no i have the little if anybody's ever got anything people get things they recognize they, people can rec register scale because they've seen things that they bought on the pillow oh yeah yeah so i'm gonna show like on the pillow look it doesn't it doesn't even it doesn't even fit okay and then for color here it is over this Oh, nice. It's beautiful. This yes. is a beautiful thing. Here it is up close. I mean, not costume by today's standards. No. Made by Coro. Okay. Probably duration because they, they didn't use pot metals during World War II. They switched over to sterling. So oh. there you go. Gorgeous. All right. Gorgeous. Very excited about that. Then should I keep going or should I not? Should you I, want to show I, another one? Go ahead. Show another okay, one. I want to show another one. This is so nice. Moon glow. So spring. Isn't there a song called moon glow? 
I Every time I hear so, that word, I'm like, what's that see, song? This is the thing. I was getting ready for tonight. I was so excited about the happy group, and then I didn't get to all of it. Look. Oh. Look how gorgeous. And it's on Lucite. It's old. This is wow. old. Look how awesome that it. This is such a good one. So 3D. I would put that on a purse, maybe, or something. I, it's just, it's so great. Such a little time castle. So reasonable. It's like new. Like oh, new. my mom I mean, uses it from the movie Picnic, the moon glow You can song. see patina on this pin, but otherwise, nothing. Not a not a drop. And it's, it's old, guys. This is not a, this is, this is... Okay, so what is jewelry made yesterday going to look like in 80 years? This is what this looks like. And it's set on clear lucite, so you can see through it. It has a really beautiful 3D effect. This is, yeah, someone just grabbed it. So great. And I have more. Look. Look. Oh, I didn't list that one yet. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm listening to Moon Glow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh, I wish we could play it. We can't play it. Da, 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 da. Okay, oh, now I know it. it. Yeah. Oh, did you listen to the, the Bonnie Wright the Bonnie Wright song I sent you the other day? Dun, 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 dun. Okay. Take make me an uh, I knew take there was a I knew there was a song. <laughs> did you did you listen to it? I sent yeah, it to you. Yeah. yeah. Isn't it beautiful? It is a beautiful song. Make me an angel. She was doing shipping. And she was like, make me a package that ships. And I was like, oh, my God, it's a song she doesn't even know. <laughs> <laughs> so do that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I got the bird. I got the bird in here now. Oh, yeah. And again, it's a butter dish. Of course it is. Uh, this is from World Market. Boop. And he's just a lovely little blue. A beautiful thing to have on your counter. I never buy butter dishes that don't have a finial. Right. I only buy the ones with a finial because yeah. I have the nightmares of going to grab the lid and then because I drop yeah. everything. Yeah. But, oh, there it goes. Oh, it's a bird. I'm giving you the bird. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> How did that get to be a thing? How did that even get to be? I don't know. I wish I knew. Does it have to do with this, the bird song? Well, everybody's heard. No. No? Yeah, but how did it get to be? Oh, do you do you sing do you ever sing Cat Stevens? I would love to hear you sing um Moon Shadow. I moon think that... Shadow, Moon Shadow. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> my first husband's favorite artist was Cat Stevens. So I just oh, I, I stop love... steer away from Cat Stevens. I getcha. I getcha. <laughs> yeah. For no particular reason, because I don't really like hold on to things like that. But that's funny. I understand. Yeah. Sometimes it's just like that. Yeah. I can't eat yogurt anymore. Frozen yogurt from the from the boutique is the is over for me. <laughs> gotcha. Well, maybe we have to break that when we get together. Yeah. <laughs> Give it a new memory. Yeah, a new memory. That's how you fix that. Yeah. Okay, I'm looking for these. So I was on a live. Oh, I can show something. Should I show something else? Uh, sure. Okay. I was on a live shopping when I when I showed this next time. So, oh wait, you show something. Okay, I love these. I don't know if they're niobium or if they might be anodized. Oh, these are coming up in a future video. Oh, oh no, I don't think you know what. I didn't tape when I got these. I just grabbed them last minute. Oh, just, see, that happens sometimes. Yeah. Well, the thing and is, you're when throwing I them all them, around the room. I know. When I grabbed them, hold on. Honestly, when I grab things like this, they're for me. But you can't, at the moment, they're for me. And then I come to my senses. You know what I mean? But sometimes I'll do that. Like, I'll play a trick on myself. And I'll be like, well, you're not videotaping it. So you have to keep it. Look. Look how, okay, let me hold, okay, oh, Lisa. Let me hold them up close. Lisa's got woodpeckers that are trying to nest in the wood siding on her house. Look how nice these are. Ooh. Okay, they have an '80s vibe, but they're really classic. Yes, that's art. what I was gonna say. They're very disco-y. They're well, they're niobium or anodized aluminum, which is very artful and not inexpensive. Like Google, <laughs> it's got Google James. No, no, James Spada, Spada, David Spada. Google da David Spada. 
and see what that's selling for. All right. This is or neobium. Look, they're wearable. They're great colors. Okay. So that's those. I made them $25. Nice. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I'm yep. trying to keep up with the chat too. I'm trying to keep up with the chat. You guys are chatty today. I love it. I love that too. I love it. I love it. I love it. Yeah. Also, you'll see uh, Idaho Gem. Chelsea is over now. Chelsea doesn't have a YouTube channel, but she is on Instagram and she's going to be joining the Niche Shopping Network as well. She's been on here once before. We did a Disney sale together and we're going to be doing some other stuff too. Awesome. I have someone in mind that I want to bring from the jewelry community, um, uh, but she's having trouble reopening her Shopify. Ah, gotcha. Oh, that's so beautiful. So I was talked into these. I was live shopping and they were, they were pricey. And I was like, I don't know, but, and I haven't tested them yet. I will, I will be perfectly honest. I priced them without testing these caps yet, but I suspect, you know what? Let me look if there's a mark. They might be sterling. They, they look like sterling. They really oh look like sterling. They're beautiful. Oh, I'm trying to unscrew the wrong thing. Custard glass. Oh. They're custard glass. How do you learn about custard glass? Is there a is there a, an abridged? <laughs> I don't know. This is, this is what the inside. Oh, lovely. Yeah, that looks looks like. I don't see a mark doesn't mean it's not there because it's very tarnished. Yeah. Oh, come on. Focus camera. Silver, silver plate, silver, silver Just plate. Just doesn't want to focus. There we go. I love them for everything. They're salt and peppers. I've never seen one with a point like that. Oh, look, we've got the dropsies now. <laughs> Always. My hands don't work well at all. I hate it one of the things that I, I miss. Okay. Got it back on. Okay. Yeah. So custard glass. Uh, so a lot of people call it milk glass because it does have a milk glass base, but custard glass has, it's, it's more creamy colored. That's like the simplest way. And it's thick, it's opaque. And does it glow? It does. Look at that. We got a glow. Oh, gorgeous. So yeah. And so I got them and I researched and I was like, oh, my, my, my. And now I always price under what I can find sold comps for in other places in the shop. Exactly. And then I also, you know, I, I have a sale category. We run sales here. We do special perks. So if you don't like the price now, if it doesn't sell, come back in a couple of weeks. Yeah, exactly. Nettie's here. Hi, Nettie. Hi. Okay. You got something? I do. Okay. You, you go. You okay. go. Oh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. That's the last. Okay. this is, I'm doing it without pictures now. So these are fringe. These are actually Chipita. You can tell by the Chipita. You can tell because they're sewn. They're oh. sewn with leather. Okay. And some Chipita is made with gemstones and some of it is made with faux because they get too heavy. These are faux. Okay. But look how fun. They were spring to me. I made them $25. They're all sewn in the leather. I mean, if you want to just even find out what Chipita is, if you need it for your source closet so that you understand it, this is a great thing to pick up. Okay. I think the leather backing is fascinating. Yeah. And it's sewn like whip stitch. Like it's really amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Like that's it's really, beautiful. that that's the hallmark of Chipita. Okay. All handmade. I'm sorry. You're These saying Chiquita. I know you're saying Chipita, and my brain is hearing Chiquita like banana. No, but look how good they look. Like it's not over the top 80s. They're just nice. You know, they're just nice. I mean, I think sometimes she just ignores my corny jokes. I just go right over it. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know why? Because that's when the fangirl comes out. Because that's that's when I found you on YouTube and I started watching your videos. The, the jokes <laughs> just made me laugh. You know, so. I just, yeah, I can't stop them. They just. It's so Sometimes you're so funny. Really. <laughs> yeah. I wish my kids thought that. <laughs> oh, they're never going to. I know. That's the thing. 
Okay, show us another one. Okay, so I have these abstract flower earrings. This is like the edge of spring. Like it's an, it's, 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 if you're edgy and you want spring. Apparently that's not me. <laughs> right. This is, this is for the urbane among us, right? They're awesome. These came from the estate sale that I went to where the woman had the, the boutique. All right. These are 1980s. They're really, really nicely done. Okay. That's all woven. Like you can see it, the matte gold. And they're not too heavy and they're post. So they look like I mean, rosette. Anywhere else, like there's money in these if you're a flipper. Honestly, they're fabulous. Okay. There's like those. Little, little rosettes. Yes, little rosettes. And then I have these. I love these. I can't. I, why did I list these for only $25? Well, I did it so fast. <laughs> okay. Is anybody like me? Originally, when I saw MOP, I thought, what are MOP? Mother wait, wait, wait. of Pearl. Mop? Mother of Look Pearl. Look how beautiful yes. these are. Those are sterling yeah. silver hooks. They're oh, the, the thick, is so pretty on thick, those. lush, good quality, thick, lush, black oyster, Mother of Pearl, darlings. Beautiful. So easy to wear. I should have made these more. These should have been 45. These really are nice. And so we should probably explain, like, because you just said black oyster, Mother of Pearl. So Mother of Pearl is literally the lining of the oyster. Your pearl. Yes come from here's the difference this is regular mother of pearl mm -hmm. also this is quite the find because these are large and you don't these are from the 70s and to find them not chipped is incredible right but this is regular mother of pearl mm -hmm. and this is black oyster yep that's where black pearl, pearls come from yep and then abalone is a whole nother thing and a lot of people call abalone mother yeah. of pearl and it is not it is abalone. Right. Yeah. But it's the it's same part of the shell. Yeah. Right. The inside of the shell. Yep. All right. There you go. So this, this is not the, okay. Because there's no pictures. I don't want there to be any confusion. These are sterling. Yeah, go slow. <laughs> These are the ones that are up right now. Yes. Okay. And if they last through the night, I will be changing my mind. <laughs> to say it they're they remind me no i won't be changing my mind i won't be but they're yeah they're gone okay <laughs> save me from myself all right that was probably okay. real. Skill. i'm kind of going down my list just now trying to find the things that i haven't shown yet oh love that i got these little guys and sadly one of them does have a little boo-boo but they're little trinket dishes and they're little like dogwood, a dogwood or gardenia. Uh, the jury's still out on which is mm. which. They do have a little signature on the back. It just says P136 I, or 1136. I can't quite make it out. It's like very, very lightly, lightly, lightly in there, which there we go. you can see it. They are older. Uh, I think they're pretty darn cool. But there they go. There I think go. so too. And do, 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 keep do, do, going. Do, do. I'm going to put on some earrings. I'm going to show the Tracy Porters. I always pick these up. Super popular. I love those. These hand painted vases are done by Tracy Porter. This one has little red flowers on a white checker background with. The green you would expect to see, all lovely hand painted, and the, oh, and it stands. And I'm trying to get better about putting measurements in the listings now, guys. I'm really working hard at it. Six and three quarter inches tall. I'm usually in such a rush to get the items in by the time my video comes out because people start looking for the stuff right away. So I'm like, okay, I'll just get it in there and I'll go back and I'll add stuff, um, but I don't always get to it. And then this one, again, in gardenias. Do we have, are the magnolias gardenias? Oh. What do you think they are? I don't know. I mean, they're flowers. They're flowers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah we'll with, they're we'll they're with flowers. Flowers. Yeah. Yeah. They're hand painted white flowers. They're so and beautiful. That one is six inches tall. So, got the two Tracy Porters. Show us some more jewels. Okay. So, this is urban 
Like this is without, this is, this is with an edge. These are petal earrings. Oh. But you see what I mean? Do you, do you, like, that's the definition, right? This is, thought I was keeping these. Uh, they're fabulous. These came from the estate of the woman who had the boutique. These are like very couture looking 1980s. Oh, this would help. No, that's not them. Here they are. Oh, yes. There you All go. All right. Petal. They're, they are uh, like gold plated or gold tone. Let me show you them up close. They have fabulous movement. They're not heavy at all. They're really easy to wear. Those are gone. Yeah, these are great. <laughs> no, you want to know something? I'm just realizing now people, when they saw these come out in the video, they got a lot of attention. People really wanted them. And I was like, no, they're mine. <laughs> And here but, you are. But that's how it works. Okay, so good shall we say it together? What shall we say it together? You can't eat jewelry. Eat jewelry, yes. Yeah, yeah. You can't drive jewelry. That's the latest thing. Oh, I feel your pain there. Yeah. Congratulations, though. Absolutely. Um, okay. And then I, I actually didn't add everything I have here, but I, I, I. Would you want to go add a couple more? I'll no, show no, a I, things. Oh, do you, you go. Do you, do sure. You, I got a couple more. Go. Okay. Yeah. All right. I have a couple more too. Oh, wait. Oh, now you got to show it. You put it up there. Now you got to show it. Okay. Here it is. The poodle. Oh, ah! <laughs> wait, what is going on? I'm, I swear to you, I'm not doing that. Okay. Yeah. This is so cute. He's from the fifties. Oh, oh, he's uh, a tortoise shell. Yeah. He's made from the same stuff that they made the barrettes out of. You got your black light. Uh, that would be good if I had it, wouldn't it? I'm sure he glows. Um, I don't know, Danny. That would have been two together. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. That's usually me. But yeah, but look, he has a face. He has an eye. I'm quite. When they're made really nice glows. like this. They're actually French. People don't know that. And um, just so people know, they're not actually made of tortoise no. shell. It's just called that because if you look at Okay, I usually I have one of these with me. When turtles, tortoises grow, they shed the pieces, like their shells are all these like pieces. It's called a scoot. They shed those. And if you pick one up and look at it, that's what it looks like. Literally oh. looks like tortoise shell. There. This is extremely nicely done, everyone. This is not five and dime, dime of the time. Look at it. Look how well it is. It's made like a nice piece of Bakelite, actually. 20 bucks. I made it 20 bucks. What are they saying? <laughs> Seduction comes cloaked in temptation. Jewelry loves that. Oh, God. <laughs> I feel like that could be like on a shirt. <laughs> He's amazing. He's a songwriter. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. Oh, can you Can you imagine hanging out with both of us together? I would love that. That would be so fun. <laughs> I would be the groupie. You guys would just be doing the things. The hits would keep coming. Yeah. Okay. Let me show. I have. I have. I'd be the one videotaping it. <laughs> a couple of Port Mirian items. Now this actually just came out in a video. Yesterday's video, or day before yesterday's video. Look at this gorgeousness. It's Port Mirian. It's called Botanic Blooms. It's a discontinued pattern. There is the mark on the bottom. Come on, come on, come on. Camera, I don't have time for your unfocused ideations here. Goodness. Somebody tell this camera. It's got to focus. There we go. See, it's seeing a little reflection. Uh, it's hibiscus flowers along the edge. It's just, it's spectacular. I love it. When I originally saw it in the store, I thought that it needed a lid or something, but I researched and nope, it never came with a lid. This is how it is in all of its glory. And then the other Port Mirian item that I have are the gorgeous candle, uh, candle sticks or candle holders. Which do you say? Oh, watch me not be able to find these now in the list. Uh, I sold several of these already. I believe this is my last two. Oh, are they really not in here? 
Oh, this software and I are going to have some serious words because I know I loaded these. I know I did it. Hi. Hi. I have to, I have to load these real quick because. Yeah. You know, you know, because we have this lovely software that loves to cooperate. Yeah. I'm getting really yeah. quick at finding these things, though. Yeah. If I spell it right. All right. So I want to entertain an offer on this. Because I really, really, really like this. This is so beautiful. It reminds me of Kirk's Folly, but I think somebody just made it. Hold on, let me show this real quick since I already showed it. Stand by. And then I can put these away. Wonder, okay. Here we go. So these, you buy them by the each. So if you want the pair, you have to put the quantity into your cart to purchase them. But they are. Oh, yes. They're Botanic Garden. So they're that one was Botanic Bloom. The picture Botanic Bloom. This one is Botanic Garden. Let's go. Come on. Oh, hey, that kind of worked. <laughs> this seems like a really good price. It's, you know, it's time for them to go. It's time for them to find a new home. My mother had those. That's what we had when, like, in, you know, she, she had that. She had, like, the olive thing and the small bowls and the candlesticks. Mm -hmm. and the, yeah. yeah. Okay. Go ahead. Okay. Do your so thing. I'm, I'm thinking about entertaining an offer on this. It's a really nice look at the sparkle. So, okay. So if this you're is doing all that, handmade. Before it's, you show the, the, uh, did you already put a price in the listing? There is no listing. I was just going to make it. After oh, you haven't. This. You'll make the listing after. Be because it's entertain an offer. Okay. Maybe like, you know, if, if, if we're going there. I, I would like to because I love it and I, I want I, I don't want to be tempted by it. I don't own anything like this. And it's really special. It's all okay. handmade. Okay, go ahead and do that. I'm going to disappear momentarily. Okay, so I had it wrapped around the bus twice. This is really beautiful crystal. There's little uh, um, uh, crystal butterfly stations. And then these are uh, pear shapes that were put together with crystal rondelles. You see that? And it goes around the bolero and it has the drops. So it's an over the head. There is no clasp, but you could definitely double this, especially if you know how to do it with pins and things like that. You could um, take a pin and put it around like this and then secure it in the back or with a bracelet in the back, right? I mean, this has a very magical quality, really reminds me of like Kirk's Folly. I'm gonna start the offers, I'm starting this at 75. Okay, I'm starting it at 75. So if someone makes me an offer of 75 and no one else offers, you will have it for 75. It's really stunning and it's handmade and it's one of a kind and it's beautiful quality and material and it's timeless and magical. It's, you know, it's like if Kirk's Folly was one of a kind. Look at it. How pretty is that? It almost, because it sparkles so much, it almost seems like it flutters. Yeah. Yeah, it's lovely. Don't worry if you don't want to make an offer today. Um, I will uh, most likely list it in an auction coming up very, very soon. Yeah, um, it's stunning. It's stunning. You can mix this. I feel like I know it seems weird. Like probably the first thought would be to put it with other crystal, but I I like the idea of putting it with black, and, and just because the sparkle is so big. It's like really got that pop with the um, the AB. So, yeah, it's really stunning. Oh, let me measure. Maybe that would help. I will measure. I will do some measuring. How about that? So from the, 
the drop on this is 14 inches. So this is a 28 inch right here. And then the pendant part or the part hanging from the butterfly with the little tassels is four inches. Okay. It's not Kirk's Folly. It's a one of a kind artist made. Yeah. Oh, someone got a bracelet. Look how pretty that is. All right. <laughs> please, please. Uh, I'm not seeing it, Maria. What What would you like for? Maria says, please. Oh. Oh, did you want this? And you uh, are you bidding? Are you, I mean, are you offering the seventy five? I don't see the offer. I'm, I'm sorry, I don't see the offer. Hello, my first purchase. Yes, starting at 75. You, oh, Melissa says 75. Yeah, no, this is beautiful. It's, I mean, stunning. Betty says 100. Oh, Betty knows. Yeah, if I put it on, I'm going to fall in love with it. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Oh, it's really good quality. This is like what Kirk's Folly wishes, right? It's like what Joan Rivers wishes. It's handmade artisan. And it's very well done. I mean, it's strong, it's sturdy, it's not delicate, you know. You can hang this, you can hang this when you're not wearing it, hang it from a window. Like it's really magical. We are at 100. We have a top offer now of 100 with Betty. Oh, thank you so much, everybody. Um, all right, I'm just gonna I'm gonna count it down. If that's the top offer, I'll count it down, and then I will um, put it in the shop with your name on it, Betty. All you have to do is go there and click on it. Okay. Uh, and here's the the countdown starting now. Don't wait until the last minute if you want to get in. All right. Ten, next bid would be oh, Melissa says one ten. Melissa's in at 110. Yeah, it's so beautiful. Look at the sparkle from back here. All right. Yes, offer. Right. We have the top offer of 115 with Nancy. Nancy offers 115. Thank you for the offers. I know. It's a and it's one of a kind. You'll never see another one. <laughs> That's the other thing. You'll never see another. And it's very well done. It's very, it's not like homemade looking. It's, it's, uh, it's very polished. Okay. We are at 115 top offer with Nancy. And you can adjust this so that it can be a choker and a hanger like that. You can really see the sparkle there. Isn't it beautiful? I think this would look really beautiful with like a fuzzy. I see this with, you know, like the usual things, right? Like, a you know, a pretty like V-neck top or whatever. But what about like a fuzzy sweater? Like imagine if you've got like a light blue fluffy sweater. You know, like maybe with a little bit of a puffy sleeve. Wouldn't that be gorgeous? Something totally different. Yeah. We are at 125. This, we are taking offers on the crystal butterfly. Oh, it's so beautiful. Yeah. Yes, we are entertaining best offers. You know what? Let me move this tray so I can put it down. So you can see the detail of it. It doesn't even have to move, right? It's just, you can just sit it right there. Look at that. Isn't that special? Uh, yeah, hot pink fuzzy. I mean, I don't want to say Angora, but something like Angora, like with just a little, like, wouldn't that be gorgeous? Like any color. I, but like, yeah, just something really dreamy and ethereal. Um, 
or silk. I mean, this would be gorgeous with silk. I mean, all like James said with jeans, a jean jacket and okay, like a band t-shirt. That's a different way to do it, right? Um, there's really fun things you can do with this. I've taken things like this and I've put them over hats and it's worked. Um, I did a video a long time ago, actually, with something like that. Top offer, Nancy. All right, should I be counting it down? I think Nancy is, hi, Angelo. All right, I'm gonna start the countdown once again. We have a top offer for Nancy. Thank you everybody for doing this. Hi, Martha, I see you. All right, I'm gonna count it down. 10, 9, 8, going once. 7, 6, 5, going twice. Oh, we have, um, I have a phone bidder. <laughs> we are at one. Oh, no, sorry, phone bidder. We already have 135 as a top offer. We have 135 as a top offer in the chat. Next offer would be 140. Okay. All right. Yes, I might have something else, Gail. I'm going to count this down. Okay. All right, top bid is 135. Next top offer is 135. Next offer is 140. 1098 going once. 765 going twice. We are at 140. We now have a top offer of 140 for the beautiful crystal butterfly necklace. 28 inch drop and four inches from here to here. All right, we are at, let me check. We have a top offer right now of 140. Thank you very much, Nancy. Goes to top offer. Um, I will put, uh, Carol, I will put it in the shop for you right now. Thank you, Carol, this goes to you. Thank you everybody for participating. I'm gonna put this in the shop right now at 140 for Carol. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> that was fun. Yes. Fun. And that was beautiful. Absolutely it's beautiful. stunning. I'm so happy. Yeah, I'm so happy because that would have been something like if I, you know how it is. <laughs> you, you, It hangs around and then you in, integrate it too much. Oh, yeah. And then, yeah. I have a cabinet like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, so let me let me uh, let me list this, and and I'll be back. Soon. Okay, I will show some things. So I just uh, found these in San Diego on my last thing, and um, it was really fun because I initially, when I went in the store, I found. What did I find? Did I find the cream? I think I found the creamer first, right? Yes, I found the creamer, and the creamer on its own, I was like smitten with because I'd never seen this false graph pattern. Oops, pattern before. And with false graph, you guys, there is, uh, there, there is, there are desirable patterns and then there are not so desirable patterns. And one of the clues is look for the made in USA. The ones that are not, are no longer made in the USA are the ones that generally don't hold a lot of value. Uh, so I was pleasantly surprised. This is a USA pattern. It's called Cape May. So then I'm shopping. And look what I found. I found its friend. Uh, so it is the creamer and the sugar. And if you guys know false graph, it has just got a nice quality feel to it. Um, a little trivia fact. Uh, this goes into treasure craft. But did you guys know that false graph and treasure craft did a little merger thing? And so you'll see a lot of pieces of treasure craft that have this same feel and look and design to them. Aha. Well, that is why. So we have those little goodies. I'm going to put them back on the shelf just because I'm running out of room anywhere else. Let's bring down my little strawberry friend, my little strawberry pixie. Look how cute she is. I don't know if you're supposed to grow strawberries in here or not, but 
Uh, it's just a nice little planter with the little strawberry pixie, just perfectly waiting. It does have the hole in the bottom for drainage. So you could actually put a living plant in this little doll right here. So I've got her. I'm gonna see before I pull something over here, make sure like it's actually in the shop here. Oh, these guys. Again, this was another, yes, Danny, pick them up. Uh, so there's a set of eight and I believe they are, I believe they're Peruvian, but they've got all these different little fun little birds and they are fabric coasters, I am told. There they are. And you're going to get all eight of them with their fun little birds. That's me. giving. This is my favorite. I don't know why. I just kind of love him. It's me giving you the bird again. They're like chickens, but not. <laughs> not really. They're not. I mean, he's like a pheasant, that one right there. Oh, two and one. There they all are. Stain free. And I do believe that they are cotton. They feel like cotton. I'm going to go with them being cotton. So there's those fun little guys there. I'm going down my list to make sure I didn't miss anything. Stand by, stand by. Got that, got that, got that. Oh. I think I might have shown every, wait. No, I don't see that. Well, there will be some things over in the collection that I may or may not be able to pull up here for you, uh, but they are in a collection over in my shop in the nicheladyshop.com called Spring Fling. I do have one more thing because I just saw it and I passed it. And I'm going to make sure that I get to it before we end. And then I'm going to do some make offer stuff. Uh, these. I actually did not know what these were when I bought them. My original intent was that I was going to sell these as individual little miniature flower pots until I did my research. <laughs> and I decided, no, Danny, you cannot, you cannot break these up. They are a family of their coffee cups. They're little Arabic coffee cups. Now, what makes these super fascinating, and maybe somebody can, I don't, I've never been on a cruise in my life. I don't know how cruises work. I don't know how fancy of a guest you have to be in order to get something like this, but these were the President's Cruise, and uh, it was an excursion across the desert. Uh, blah, 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 blah. You can read it there. As a memento of the moving experience we all shared at Wadi Rum and our Bedouin dinner, please accept this Bedouin coffee set handmade of clay from the Dead Sea. And it's from the CEO, President and CEO of Crystal Cruises, Tom Wolber. I, that's, I know as much as you know by reading that, but... So I, I assume you had to be pretty fancy to get a set. It has of, to do with Lawrence of Arabia, the film. It, well, it, well, it said today's excursion across the desert inspired memories of the classic film Lawrence of Arabia and created new oh. memories of our adventure of discovery together. No real memento. Can I see one up close? I think it's pretty. They're they're fabulous. They're really lovely. And they're Bedouin. Yeah. They're Bedouin. Bedouin. Is that how you say it? I. It's so mysterious to me because the desert doesn't have water. They're from the clay of the Dead Sea. Oh, my gosh. That's so cool. Yes. Oh, those are beautiful. There you go. I, nice find on that. Those are yeah. awesome. None other like it out there with its provenance. And it comes in the little, the original box, too. It's, it's the original. It's the box that... Um, they came with. Ta -da! Anybody know? Like, I don't know, because I'm not a cruiser. So is that, I mean, if you're going to that area, that, that couldn't have been a cheap cruise. I'm just saying. It was probably not a cheap cruise. 
Beduan, Beduan. You're seeing camels. <laughs> you still see items in Dawn's shop? Well, the shops don't get emptied out, but we just, we have special things that we bring to the particular collections. Uh, so yeah, you are free to shop Dawn's shop. We just had particular things that we were showing here on the Niche Shopping Network. I feel like this has been one of our funnest shows yet. I just want to say, and Don will be back in a minute. Um, but what we wanted to build here was a community. And as I said earlier, it is not going to be just about Don and I. We are starting to bring on some others that we feel worthy of introducing to you uh, as part of this fabulous reseller community. And, you know, there's certain criteria that is needed to be involved. We still have some really big things in the works. Give us about another month and uh, we're going to be rolling out some new features to all of this. And uh, we super appreciate you guys sharing the channel for now with, with others as you find it. And we're going to be doing a lot more stuff here. Um, as I said, now that I've got my life kind of like back in, uh, I don't know, I, I wouldn't say, uh, I wouldn't say that it's, I don't even know the word. Um, perfect. Nothing's ever perfect. Not perfect. I mean, it's Fully a little bad. chaotic. I was going to say yeah. it's not chaotic, but my life's always chaotic. That's, I can remember being in junior high school and there's an assignment due on Monday and I'm waiting till Sunday night to even start it. Like that's, that's just yeah. me. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I kind of thrive on chaos and, you know, yeah. all of that. But anyway, um, but no, I do have, you know, the time now to get this part of my life back into a normal functioning routine. So I'm going to start uh, picking up and picking up some slack here. And I enjoyed this so much. This was one of the most fun shows I think we we've, we've ever done or I've ever done. It was just so joyful and happy. I want to integrate this. Maybe we can make it like it doesn't have to be spring. Maybe we could call it like, come on, get happy. Can we just sing this together? Come on, get happy. No, no, no. Look, look what I just put on screen. We are the world. Oh, Jane. We are the world. We are, we are the, the jewelry. jewelry. You know, I'm going to finish those lyrics, right? You know, I'm going to like find more to go with that. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good one. <laughs> yeah. But really, come on, get happy. This is a very happy, this is a joyful, uh, this is fun. I mean, I want to go back and watch this just to see the things like so fun. Yeah. Yes. So um, I'm going to watch it. I'm going to watch it and replay. Can't wait. <laughs> cool. Yeah. So we appreciate each and every one of you who is watching this on the replay. If you couldn't be with us live, that is why we did this the way we did. Obviously, there's some things that, you know, when we do like the make offer things and, and I'm going to do one of those and we're going to do some giveaways here uh, before we end. Uh, mm -hmm. But we super appreciate you. And any of those QR codes, you can go over to the shop. You can find the things. We are real people. Um, there's ways to message us. If you know, if you want to make an offer on something, you can do that through the messaging system on the shops. Uh, so we're we're happy to entertain that as well. <laughs> They're all singing it now. I love it. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> So let me pick an item. Hmm. I see what's still available before I like sell somebody's thing, you know. Yeah. I. Let me. Hmm. And then we're going to do a giveaway. Okay. I'm afraid they're going to hear my stomach growling. Uh-oh. I never eat dinner. I sadly had I, I crammed down a hot pocket like right before. no that's it i know like the worst the worst but you know you do what you gotta do yeah okay 
Let me see what I have here that you guys might, you got any throw an item out. If there's an item. Oh, oh Betty, yeah. thank you so much. That is so appreciated. Oh, Betty, how sweet is that? Thank you, Betty. I feel like I need to move. I need to move some bunny stuff. Oh, oh, the bunnies. Yes, definitely. I need to move some bunny stuff. So let me. What's the plan? Let's see. Let me see what I got. Let me see what I got. Okay. These are items because I'm going to get a little crazy here. The Arthur Court. Arthur Court. Nobody's purchased this. I am going to entertain offers on the Arthur Court bunny. Ooh, okay. Are you ready for it? Heart. I'm going to entertain offers over six bucks. Six dollars and little 1994 Arthur Court bunny. There's the mark. And I'm going to go fast. So if you're thinking about it, don't wait. Bunnies, bunnies, bunnies. I have owned bunnies, actually. I have I have raised bunnies. All right. I got some bunny lovers coming in. Nancy, I see your $7. Valerie. Oh, I'll just wait until you guys battle it out a little bit. And the way it'll work, once we accept the top offer, it'll be in the shop with your name on it. You'll still have to go over and purchase it. I just noticed he has orchids. How fun is that? Uh, Arthur Court is aluminum. Aluminum, aluminum. Your bunny is 12 years old. What kind? I had a French lop. And then I also had uh, lions. All right. All right. All right, I'm going to count it down. I'm just going to go five, four, three, two, one. Bing, 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 bing. I see Nancy. So let me go change that price. I'm going to put your name on him. Oh, shoot. Valerie came in. Valerie came in at 16, right above the sold. I'm so sorry. All right. I'm sorry, Nancy. Yep, I see it. I see it. Okay, so Valerie, that is over there for you to go claim. Um, you'll have to go into the spring fling category. Go find that. It's got your name on it. You should be able to even search your name. The other bunny item was the little green box dish. I'm sorry to interrupt. I feel like there was another offer, but I'm not sure. Um, Kelly H might have oh you know i missed it because there was it was like in a sentence yes oops ah uh, what it's to a do? super sweet little trinket dish i really love it yeah and kelly h your stuff actually is already gone so Oh, and fine. I'm sure that changes things as far as like the shipping. Yeah. Okay. She's it's, she's fine with it. Okay. Okay. All right. Sorry about that. I missed it. Always put your number first. I and think then... we're lagging, Danny. We are. Yeah. What do you mean? I mean, I was I was watching it on on, an, on another feed, and. Somehow we're waiting. we're not lagging. The feed is, is you know yeah, whatever you were watching. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, you know what I mean. That I mean that's a thing. Yeah, that's why you always get to got to give like thirty seconds and just know that it's gonna probably be yeah. like a thirty second lag for some people. Yeah, 
Okay. Just my brain for this. this guy. Let me just do something really quick because I don't want anybody going in there and snagging it. I'm going to start this guy at five. Offers are being entertained over $5 for this little guy. All right. Let me let you do your thing. For the little green box, little bunnies smelling the butterflies. Artwork by Kathy Walters. And I will get these out first thing tomorrow. They will go out in tomorrow's mail so bunnies can get delivered by Easter. Yep, it's and it's the time of day. There's a lot of people online on Sunday afternoons too. So depending where you're at, the lag could be bad. But always make sure you can kind of refresh, get back into live chat that catches you up as quick as you can be. All right, Nancy, I see you for $8. I'm going to count it down. Five, four, three. Oh, Joanne, I think you're, I, okay, Joanne is lagging and responding to something before. So I'm going to say two, one, somebody can give me a, just a stop in there in the chat. Actually, I could have typed it in. Uh, uh, that is going to Nancy for $8. Final. There we go. All right, Nancy, let me get that for you into the shop. All right. Groovy. It's there waiting for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Roku is faster than phone because I keep getting commercials. Oh, you know, YouTube controls that. We can't. It's YouTube. <laughs> we appreciate you watching them, though. Super, super appreciate it. All right. I don't know where Dawn went. We're going to give some stuff away. Stuff away. And again, you guys are always welcome to make offers on things over in the shop. Also watch. I will probably do some markdowns on Tuesday of some things that are in the spring fling uh, collection. So watch for that on Tuesday. I'm going to do those markdowns. Um, that way people who are watching on the replay have a little bit of time to get in there, grab some stuff before you guys go in there and go, Oh, now I want it. Um, or send an offer. Cause that'll work too. Let me grab my stuff that I'm giving away. I got some spring, spring stuff. All right, Don, where'd you go? My friend, you got to help me with this giveaway thing. All right. I'm pulling, I have been standing this whole time and now I need to sit. <laughs> I have to sit back down. <coughs> okay. Goodness. All right. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Uh, let's see. Let's see if you guys got over there and got your items claimed. Not yet. All right. Uh, maybe someone could put the link just to that collection. Not the whole shop, but just the collection, the spring fling. Say that three times fast. Yeah. Spring fling, spring fling, spring fling. Wow, that's hard. <laughs> I'm actually pulling it up so I can put it over. <coughs> I can't talk. Yes, it's got your name on it. So you should be able to easily search and find it. Okay. Should we get some stuff away? Yeah. You okay? I tried to eat a little piece of chicken that was dry. Oh, no. And now I know what it means when people say, choke it down. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh, but oh, my goodness. You've been there. Okay. You need to go, no, you need to go uh, take a drink. That's okay. <laughs> we made her cry, you guys. That's it. We made her cry. Okay. Okay. So we're going to. An elevator. What? I think that should be the word. No. What's our word? Spring. What's our word? Spring. Spring. Of course. Spring. Okay. <clears throat> so my first item 
I'm going to give away is yeah. this beautiful peacock box. Look at that. Oh. I'm giving it away. It's lovely. It's by Punch Studio. So it probably came with like stationery. But it. I thought it was appropriate because it's actually got a little jeweled, you know, little, little handle. So put the word spring. You can put it more than once. You don't have to just put it once. There's no crying in jewelry. <laughs> <laughs> James yes, says, thank you later with that wine. So much. There's <laughs> no crying in joy. Who said that? That's brilliant. Who was that? That was uh oh, Lindsay. Lindsay. Oh gosh. <coughs> Lynn. Okay. All right. We have a lot of um entries coming in. Excellent, excellent. First, Spring. first person to get it is gonna be well, I think they're still coming in. You have to wait until it slows down a little. <clears throat> right. Look, they're coming in so fast. Thank you, Valerie. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. What do you say, Danny? When should I do it? Yeah, five, four, three, two, one. Blast off. Look who it is. Is Melissa it Melissa? Reset. Melissa got it. Melissa! Congratulations. Hey, I have a package Melissa. to send you too. So <clears throat> that works out well. Yay, Melissa. Congratulations. All right. This little guy I promised I was giving this little guy away. Now, he does. He, he's this is what I like about these giveaways, because if you don't want it, don't enter. Uh, but if you you would like to give him a new home, then go ahead and enter. Um he is from East Germany, which Ooh, kind of dates awesome. him. But I don't know what he held in his little arms there. But hopefully one of our crafty people can repurpose him. But look. Look. If he was perfect, he'd be like $25. Mm -hmm. So let's put the word. Chick. 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 Love it. Chick. That way we have a whole new round here. C-H-I-C-K. C-H-I-C-K. C-K. Chick. Chick. He says, Chick. <laughs> <clears throat> I sold an Aflac Monopoly. No, Aflac uh, operation game. And I yeah. and now that it's like been delivered, I have to I have to reach out and ask. Okay, I gotta know. When you hit the side, does it go Aflac? And that'd be so, hysterical. Yeah. Chick. Chick is the new word. You hit the funny bone. <laughs> Chick is the shtick. <laughs> Chickity doo da. Chickity oh. a. <clears throat> my, my, oh, my. my. What a wonderful, wonderful day. day. I just found out that Jordan, they're, it's her, her, what do you call it? Oh my God. Like a bachelorette party kind of thing, I oh, guess. Yeah. I guess it's a bachelorette. They're going to Disneyland. And I'm like, and you weren't going to invite me? Like, what? Wow. I know, right? Rude. Wow. So I invited myself. Good. <laughs> Very good. Okay, I'm going to do this. All right, let's pick a let's pick a chick. Christy Coleman. Christy Coleman. Christy Coleman. And Christy, at I you. don't little leave. I don't have your info, so make sure you email me, the niche lady at gmail.com with your info so I can send that to you. Yep. Yep. Should we do one more? Yes, let's do one more. All right. I love this. It's the bird box. Oh, that you is. You are stronger sweet. than you think. All right. Let's make the <clears throat> word mm, flowers. Flowers. Or sure. no, garden, garden. Wait, make make up your mind. Garden. Make them type for it. Flowers. Let's go flowers. Okay, flowers. Make make them type the extra letters. It's a good it's a good giveaway. <laughs> yeah, it is a good giveaway. It definitely is a good giveaway. Ooh, that was that was that was mean of me. <laughs> flowers. flowers. Flowers is the word. Yes, flowers is the word for the flower box. Flowers. I need to go find me some black M&Ms. 
not M not M and M's. Um, jelly beans. Why did I say M and M's? Why? Why jelly they... beans? But why black ones? God, they're my favorite. Oh, the licorice. Yeah, the licorice ones. We have that in common. Oh, that's my candy of choice when I need to edit. And I have that little, I've, it's always been licorice for me. Always. Nice. Try the Egyptian licorice tea. It's really good without the oh. sugar. And it works. It gives you the same licorice. I think I crave it because of my, um, like low bread pressure or something like, so it, it, that tea is awesome. Okay. All right. All <clears throat> right. Try the tea. <laughs> Christy said, I just, I just said, I want a chick. And my husband asked, is it alive? <laughs> Does he know me? <laughs> yes. All right. No, Flowers no, is the word. Five, four, oh, oh, three. I went, wait, 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 wait. two, okay. and one and a half. Ready? One. Let's draw it. Joanne Nering. Joanne. Joanne Nering. The little yeah. flower box. So again, yeah. make sure that you email me at the niche lady at gmail.com. And it helps if you put winner like in the, oh, oh yes. tell me what you won. Please tell me what you won. I'm sure Melissa is keeping track for me. Yeah. And the subject put winner flower, winner chick. Please, right. please, please. Yeah. I get hundreds of emails a day. And uh, I used to have help with that and I don't have help anymore. Yeah. So yeah, it really helps. I can look for that subject line. Yeah. yeah. I'm doing all my shipping tomorrow, everybody. Me so, too. Yeah. I um I have things that I still need to ship from Wednesday. I think this is the new groove I'm gonna be in. I think I I think I'm my shipping day is gonna be Monday. I think it just makes sense for busy the busyness that I have. Yeah. I used to ship like every day, but I just can't do that anymore, you know. Yeah, <laughs> I'm like I'm looking and going, okay, I still have six things to ship from a sale I did last week. So I got this. I got this. You got it. You totally got it. Yeah. All right. Are you um are you doing buttons? I'm just reading some of the cute comments. I love when you guys share your stories. So good. Yeah. All right, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with us for almost three hours. Thank you fun. so much for being here. Yeah. We'll yeah. be back on Friday with I don't think I'm going to make it this Tuesday. I'm going to start doing Tuesdays, but not this Tuesday. Right. Right. But so Oh, go Friday. watch my video, please. If you haven't already, go watch my video and, and, uh, Oh yeah. Watch today. hers and watch mine. Oh, that's right. Yours is out now too. We both okay. have videos out today. Yeah. Yeah. So if you want to hang around YouTube for a while, there you go. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. We love you all. Thank you so much for making this such a fun experience for us, for the chat. And with that, go find, go your, find joy. your joy.